Oh, hey. What's up? <sighs> we have a wheel to spin. Ah! I'm nervous. I'm nervous because there are games on here that could be really, like, good or really scary. Good job clearing Silent Hill and let's hope good roll for Resident Evil. Ah, no! Holy shit, old and flexible, thank you so fucking much for a thousand bits. If 17 months is what it takes to get the Fester's Quest playthrough, so be it. No, what's happening? All right, all right, all right. Old and flexible, thank you so much for the thousand bits. It's a lot of, it's a lot of beats in the ground. Thank you. I really, really appreciate it. And thank you for the congratulations. Max, thank you for resubbing for 15th month. I saw that. Thank you. Uh, VT, oh, no. thank you for resubbing, but I don't want to play Fester's Quest. <laughs> Luciano, thank you for resubbing. Oh, fuck, a tier two. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Enjoy your whole list of raviolis and slices and good emotes. <laughs> All the emotes are good. I shouldn't say that. Thank you. Welcome back, everyone. Are any of these games ones you're looking forward to playing? Yes. Since we can't stack the deck with Star Control 2, let's play Grim Fandango instead. One of them. D Holmes. Why, yes, that is the one that I kind of want to play. Thank you so much for resubbing a tier two as well. What the fuck? You guys are incredible. Thank you. Oh, too nice. Oh, geez. Since I've subbed, you've played three of my favorite games of all time FFT, Musashi, Silent Hill 2. Two of them are or have been on polls Metal Gear Solid 2, Breath of Fire 3. Now you just need to get Mega Man Legends. Tis them for all the fun playthroughs. Oh, thank you so fucking much, Red Davison. That is so sweet. I do need to get... You're right, I do need to get that. And I will play those other ones. Thank you. The fuck? Oh my god. Oh good. Wait. Uh, Bren, thank you for gifting us up to Sartorius. That is very sweet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Resident Evil is October Star Control 2. That's... True. <laughs> Uh, works with forks. Thank you for resubbing it to your three. What the fuck? Thank you very much. Jesus. That's the, the, I don't know what to call them. People call them like god subs and things like that. I don't know. It's like the special one with a crown. Thank you so much. Uh, Shirayoni, thank you. What the fuck? Thank you for gifting 10 subs. What are you guys doing? We just, <laughs> we're just spinning a wheel today. Um... Thank you for gifting subs to Vegan Called Quest, Let's Go Buck 69, Acer 1919, Cords of Steel 97, Abra Matt, uh, Green Turtle 112, Christofax, The Emblan, Dradius, and Stench. Thank you, Shadow. Grimstar Candango 2. What? God <laughs> You should have put Devil May Cry 3 on the list. I don't, I don't have own 10 it. gift subs, but I do have 100 bits. So, that's like the same, right? Thank you very much. Okay, wait. Slow down. Zax, thank you for gifting a sub to Snooze McDougal. That's very sweet. Phoenix, you had a very good joke. And that's basically what it is. It's never gonna win. Zax, thank you for resubbing. Welcome back. Thank you for supporting me, Zax. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Max. It is the same. It is. Hold on, I'm trying to read what you guys are saying. In between all of this. Oh, thank you, Zax. Resident you your... Evil, this is your time to shine. Oh, God. You realize your bits aren't gonna... It's channel points. There is no slowing down. This train will never end. Until it does. Good luck trying to start the stream. This is very, Grim very Fandango sweet is a game Thank about you. an extremely dure supporter of Japanese dumplings. Right? What? <laughs> You're right, Shiroyoni. Silent Hill cannot scare me anymore, I hope. Actually, I had nightmares again last night for the third night in a row. I wonder why. Uh, Scoops McGee, thank you for gifting five subs. Jesus. 
to crack tune, pay doodle, unstable deus, and <laughs> silence crab, and dorgville. God damn it. You guys have such good fucking names. Just spinning the wheel, she says. Well, I'm gonna. You see three games you like in there? Hold on. People have questions about them. I'll say them in a second. This wheel has no power over me anymore. I've played and beat the original Resident Evil doll. I, I heard, and I'm mad that I couldn't watch, but you know the you know the deal. But hey, you did it yourself. Super cool as it goes to watch twitch.tv slash Carcella. Okay, I'm done now. I think. <laughs> the Tarot Max, thank you. No Luigi's Mansion 3? That's not retro! Please accept these bits that are designed to continue preventing you from properly starting the stream. The stream that we are all watching. Watching live. Here on twitch.television forward slash Carcella. Thanks. Shirayoni, thank you very much for uh, the bits about Resident Evil being my time to shine. I don't agree, but okay. Jokes on you, we're the number one wheel spinning enthusiast community in the world. <laughs> that might be true. Silent Hill will do that to you. Here's to different types of nightmares. Hey. Fuck, man. Uh. Okay, all right. Max, thank you for the bits. Gr Mildane, thank you for the bits. Resident <laughs> Evil has to win. It just has to. Insert very amusingly long joke here that will go on and on and on and on. <clears throat> Painkiller should go on the list? Tell Rain, I don't know what that is. Bravest streamer. I am getting more brave, maybe. Twitch.tv slash Carcala? Got it. Oh, that was just a one. It's gonna be ten. Uh, uh, wait, no, a hundred. This is my last bit. I was saving it for a special occasion. I'll read it. Thank you. <laughs> Hold on. I have to fucking thank all of you, and I have to read what you're all saying. Did Pyramid Head visit you in your dreams and give you an apple pie? No, but I had a really, really creepy body horror dream. I have no jokes. I just like to interrupt people. Uh, okay. Max, thank you for another 100 bits. I hope Resident Evil, but I'm up for any of these. In your restless dreams, you saw that town? No. Sorry, I missed that Zelda. Could you repeat it? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Copy paste of war and peace detected and removed. <laughs> God damn it. I'm going to spin this fucking wheel because you're going to run out. Moo. Moo? <clears throat> Let's try this again. Brand, thank you very much for the bits. Portal 2 isn't retro. That's special. Weekend streams are special. Miss Silent 2? Uh, oh, the VODs are still there and I'll save them forever. Oh, you're very welcome. Giving bits is my pleasure and I will continue to do it every time. That is how much I enjoy twitch.television forward slash Carcala. It's twitch.tv slash Carcella, Phoenix. Oh my god, do I have time to talk? Okay. Uh, Gilmer, thank you for gifting us up to August. D d t uh, this time your bad dreams were the dog's fault? Yeah, probably. Uh, Despears, thank you for the 100 bits. All scary games should have dog endings, I agree. Uh, Red Davison, thank you for the 100 bits. Everyone needs to stop. You guys have given me too many things. Uh, Phoenix, thank you for more bits. To be completely fair, Silent Hill is far scarier than Resident Evil. People say that, but I don't believe anything anymore. Uh, hey, Grey Armor. Zeldy, thank you for the bits. Jive Turkey, thank you for the bit. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Only 80k more for community challenge? Fuck yeah. There's another one after that. And then there's gonna- and then you'll have completed all of them. Um, Spooky Bad Chicos, thank you for the 100 bits, even if you're interrupting people. Phoenix, thank you for the 128 okay, bits. Okay, folks, that's the stream. Come back tomorrow for more wheel spinning on twitch.tv slash Carcala. Incorrect. That's a lie message. Dear Jive Turkey, I love you and this is for you. This is my last bit. I was saving it for a special occasion. I heard we are interrupting.
<laughs> um, stop interrupting guys, Kappa. I don't have points to stack the deck, but here is my plea, Resident Evil will be fun for you and me. Praise the wheel. Karkul Carrot. This song is perfect. You're all clowns. All right. Anyway, Austin, thank you for the bits. Um, Anonymous Ghost, thank you for the bits. Mildine, Moo. Um, 420k raised for the costume of the sex number. <laughs> Shit. I just really love the bit sound. That's very nice. Uh, Bren, thank you for the bits. Zeldy, thank you for the bits. What the fuck? When did you do this? Shiroimi, thank you for gifting 11 subs. Oh, son of a... Shiroimi, thank you for um, finishing our, our sub goal on, thir on Thursday. It's Thursday. It's Thursday. It's Thursday. The bit sound is pretty good. Congrats to... Uh, a moon sock tea? Uh, Jamaralis 603, me and Tempe Guidoni, uh, Smart X, no, Smart LX, Pit the Potter, Zinkato, Velour Fog, Altoon Res, Phi Sol 34099. Plobbins! Thank you, Shiroyoni. That's too many, though. Put, take the back. <laughs> Why? Or is it more bling? Oh my god. We are going to play a game today. Max, thank you for the bits. Android account, thank you for pledging your love to Jive Turkey. Ping. Gilmer, thank you for the bits. We're almost there, we might as well. Dude, thank you. Rain was joking yesterday that there's no way we were gonna reach it. He was like, we're gonna have a weekend off finally. Oh, I think it is playing. Playing? Zeldy, thank you for the bits. Just skip the wheel and play Resident Evil now. I don't want to play Resident Evil. Burr burr dang. Burr burr dang. Oh my god. Red Davison, thank you for the bits. Uh. Resident Evil has more jump scares. Fuck! It's a party in her already? Yeah, well, we'll get to it. Plowing. Plowing? I don't think it... Alright. Swicky Veggie goes, thank you for the bits. How many points to replace Super Goals and Ghosts with Demon's Crest? You have to take that up with Rain. He made the poll today. Ha 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 wheel. weekend off. Keep dreaming. Not until you change the sub goal. I've been changing it every week! <laughs> Ugh. I, I'm, not, I'm not playing any of the games yet. We still haven't fucking spun. Uh, Gilmer, thank you for the bits. Phoenix, thank you for the bits. Phoenix, thank you for more bits. Red Davison, thank you for the bits. Uh, Naki Ainen, thank you for resubbing. Welcome back. Phoenix, thank you for more bits. Boots, thank you for bits. Gilmer, thank you for gifting us up to Natez85. Eddie, thank you for the bits. Shironi, thank you for the bits. <sighs> Spoiler, Resident Evil has evil in its residence now. Okay, all right, am I free? Yes, okay, all right, you idiots, stop. So, we're spinning a wheel. Your options are, um, Fear, Resident Evil, Fester's Quest, Grim, sorry, it's kind of scooshed, but it'll get better. Grim Fandango, uh, Gabriel Knight, Sins of the Father. I couldn't fit it all, obviously. And then Super Ghosts and Ghouls, I believe, is, what it's called? It's the SNES one. It's they all have weird similar names, but they all start with G's. Anyway. So step one. It's original resonating. It's ugh. It's original big box resident evil. Yeah, it's called Super Ghouls and Ghosts, not Ghosts and Ghouls. Ghouls and Ghosts. You can't see that. Anyway. Ahem. So. Uh, let's see. 
Okay, step one, we're going to let you guys stack the deck. If there's an option on, it's over here. If there's an option on this wheel that you would like to um, give another chance to, another pie slice in the wheel of fate, uh, I am going to be unlocking a channel point redemption called stack the deck. It's red, it costs 20K. When I unlock it, five lucky people will get the opportunity to add a slice to the game they want. You have to type it in, so prepare it, okay? I'm going to count back from five, and then the first five people get it, and that's it, okay? After that, we're gonna do spinning, and I'll talk about how that works after we do this. So, prepare your favorite, think in your brain. Hmm, what do I want to make have better odds? That was English. All right, I'm gonna count back from five. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, Jesus. God damn, <laughs> see that. All right, let's, uh, let's add these in. Austin was first, very fast. You've been first quite a few times. Uh, adding Grim Fandango, okay. Then Black Labad is adding Resident Evil. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, VT is adding Christopher Lloyd as Fester's Quest. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, Boots is adding Resident Evil. Thank you. And D Holmes is adding Star Control 2. Haha, <laughs> JK, just Grim Fandango. Okay. Uh. All right, so that's one, two, three, four, five. Grim Fandango, Resident Evil, Fester's Quest, Resident Evil, Grim Fandango. Got it. All right, let's update this. Made it in time. Hey, Wuyaneka. Fun stacks. I, it goes really, really quick. So here's the new wheel. Uh, hold on. I the ampersand is breaking on Super Ghouls and Ghosts. Uh, let's see if that looks a little better. Oh, I did use an N. <laughs> My internet is too slow to do stacking. I'm sorry. Yeah, I, it's you've got to be like I couldn't. I wanted it to be that anyone could add stuff, but then the wheel would be like tiny little slices so we'd never be able to see what won. In lieu of a Resident Evil victory, I'm going to vote root for Gabriel Knight. Oh. Hey, Rogue Wear Cat, you have a cool name. Did Fear win? No, nothing is won yet. We haven't spun. All right. Pause. Now, I'm going to put a secret timer on my cellular device <laughs> so you guys can't cheat. However, if you work together, if you work together, you may be able to all stop spinning and get the game that you want. Or when everyone's excited that it landed on the dumb game that you all want, one person could be chaotic and fuck it all up. Or you could just throw all your spins at it once and pray to, uh, you know, the Halloween gods. So I'm going to count down and you guys are gonna be able to redeem, redeem spins. Remember, spins are redeemed through channel points. It's the thing at the bottom of the chat. All right, we're gonna start in five, four, three, two, one. Cesario Rose is the first spinner. Here you go, my dear. It could have been Resident Evil, but you all came in here. Here you go, Shadow. Look at all this chaotic energy, what the fuck? Grim Fandango. Penrose hates Grim Fandango. Holy ravioli, that's a lot of fucking spins. Uh, Grim Fandango, nope. Chad, this is your spin. Holy crap. Everybody's in here. Fear, ah, there's something in my eye. Ultima, here's your spin while I can't see. Wow, Resident Evil is never gonna win now because everyone's gonna stop it. Syphos, this is for you. I was told these are channel points. No, they're not! Grim Fandango B hates, notoriously hates Grim Fandango. Thank you very much, Prince N. Uh, Resident Evil. Wow, look at all these times we could have had Resident Evil, but Shiroyoni was like, I hate 
that game. Wow. You could have worked together. Jive Turkey, enjoy your spin. We're getting Resident Evil today? I don't know. Everybody's spinning too much. Ooh, Gabriel Knight. B has another spin in here. Here you go, B. There's something in my right eye and I have to close it. I can't see. Zeldy, here. Oh my god, this is so fucking chaotic. What the hell? Fester's quest? Yeah, no thanks. B, thanks for coming back and being like, ha uh, No. B is gonna be my savior this year, I can feel it. Grim Fandango, Triple Zero doesn't want me to play any adventure games. Why, Triple Zero? What is that? Super gobbledy goobledy. Sartorius really doesn't want me to suffer anymore this year. I literally can't see out of one of my eyes, so good luck. I don't know. I think that's Grim Furble. J Cookie, spin. Super guac and moly, yes. Uh, ooh, interesting. Chad says no, though. That's apparently the um harvester of the year. If you guys are wondering what that game is. Oh, almost got a Resident Evil. Black Labbit says no. Shadow doesn't like Resident Evil. I said that earlier. I can't see. Grim? Old and flexible doesn't like Grim anymore. Wow. What a fucking heel turn. Super Grim Fandango. Stop the spin. Ooh, maybe we will get it. Boots is against me though. Why? <gasps> That's it. The redemptions are up. All right. That's Gabriel Knight. Uh, that guy in HBO has a spin. And then we have two more after this. So much for working together. Grim Fandango, all right. Broken Quest, this is your spin. That's Resident Evil. All right, Zex, this is the final spin. So your spin decides it. Whatever this is wins. for the 520 wait 512 i'm not dyslexic i am a little thank you very much for the bits well i guess i should just throw this game away Oops. yay <laughs> luciano thank you so much all right we're playing grim fandango some type of uh point and click game I think. Cool. Uh, Rain played this before and I saw a little bit of it. There were skeletons and... Can I just give mega car? credit to Kala's worried portrait in the wheel? I don't read that. Thank you very much, Alley Cat. <laughs> I love the way she says yay. I do too. <laughs> Thank you, Luciano. All right, Grim, Grim f f Fart Dongles. Uh, let's see. More like Grim Fandang, no. Really? Thank you, James. You know, I really do think if you work together, we could have played Resident Evil. But once again, Brimstone Dongle? <laughs> once again. <sighs> it just didn't happen. What a shame. I guess Birthday Shark's gonna have to play it again. You don't want to play Resident Evil, though? It's gin and mangoes. Oh, it's a LucasArts classic? Oh, hell yeah! All right, I... <laughs> we'll come back for you someday, Resident Evil. Remember, this isn't the end. I don't know how long this game is, but we have a whole one... Okay, so today, tomorrow, and then five more... We have like seven more days of streaming in this month, so... Maybe we will play Resident Evil. All right, I'm gonna set this up. Uh, thank you guys for spinning. Uh, we're gonna play Grim Fandango until we uh, lose or win. What? Why did I say lose? And then maybe we'll spin the wheel again. I'll be right back. Ooh.
¿Qué es esto? It's immediately talking to me. Ah! Do you see my problem? ¿Qué es esto? Shut up. Hey, sorry. It's super loud. I'm trying to make it stop. It's very loud. It's a computer game. I don't have time to test it. Uh, I'll hydrate in a second. <laughs> oh my god. All right, all right, all right. Do one of these. Hey, look, it's Steam. Don't don't yell at me. I'm sorry it's so loud. Close close your ears. Meet the stream. Sorry for the wait, Mr. Flores. I am ready to take you now. Take me? Take me where? No, no. There's no need to be nervous. Nervous? No. It's just your appearance. It's a little intimidating. Intimidating? Me? But I'm your friend. My name's Manny Calavera. I'm your new travel agent. I don't want a new travel agent. I want to go home. <laughs> you can't go home, Celso. You're dead. But you're not alone. Everybody here is just as dead as you. That's why we call it the land of the dead. Are you ready for your big journey? No. What journey? The four-year journey of the soul. It is quite a big trip. And I can't lie to you, Celso. It could be very, very dangerous. Unless you were to take that money you were buried with and buy a better travel package from us. I mean, wouldn't you rather cross the land of the dead in your own sports car? Maybe try a luxury ocean cruise? Or... If you led a very good life, you may even be eligible for a ticket on the number nine itself. The number nine? That's our top-of-the-line express train. It shoots straight to the ninth underworld, the land of eternal rest, in four minutes instead of four years. But very few people qualify. Let's take a look at your records. So much is mm -hmm. happening. Mm -hmm. Well. The bad news is the train appears to be just out of your reach, but I still got a couple of tricks up my sleeve here. Mm-hmm. Aha! Yes, that's the ticket. The Excelsior Line. Yes, she's a beauty. That compass and the handle would sure come in handy, too. Oh, you're going to have a great trip. Wish I was going. Why don't you? You could give me a lift. Oh, I can't leave here until I've worked off a little debt to the powers that be. Community service, eh? Well, I guess there are some folks worse off than me. Oh, I'll be leaving here soon enough. No thanks to dead and no commission low-life cases like yours, Menso. Hey, Manny. The boss told me to tell you not to leave early tonight. He wants to talk to you about something when he gets back from his trip. Tell Don not to worry. I'm not going anywhere. Especially not with clients like that. Where do they get these guys? They don't qualify <laughs> for anything good, so I can't sell anything good. I can't work off my time, and I'm stuck. Stuck selling walking sticks to a bunch of burros for eternity. I need better clients. I need a real saint. I need a lead on a rich, dead saint. Oh. Hmm. ¿Qué es esto? Okay. So. Now am I allowed options? There we go. Alright. Sorry about the fucking volume, guys. It was absolutely bonkers high. I'm gonna keep the voices kind of high. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna put that back where it was. <laughs> Hopefully it sounds okay. And we'll go from there. Do we have subtitles? 
text mode, voice and text. Volume was okay. Oh shit. All right. We'll leave it where it was. Well, so uh, how do I explain this? I had to turn this down and then turn something on the behind the scenes up. No. If that makes sense. So it's technically getting, it should be the same, but we'll test it out. Voice and text. All right. How's this? <laughs> Thank you, Luciano. Just a heads up, save a fucking lot. This game is prone to crashing. Oh shit, okay. All right, well, should I save now? Sure. Oh, I only have four? All right, whatever. What's this? Ah! The hell? My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. How's that? Does the volume sound good? No save, only play. Okay. You can't see this, but there are... Whoa. My camera is framing. Hold on. I can fix this. Uh, I can fix that. I can change it. Game is framey. I can fix it. It's gonna go away for a second. Don't worry. Everything's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. This is the wonder of a... Uh... My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. That's interesting. I'm gonna fix it, don't worry. We'll get it. It just doesn't think this is a game. Why can't I run around? Sorry, I'm doing weird things. screen hold on don't look at these things uh oh shaya thank you for gifting us up to ocn guy we're gonna play this fucking game i'm gonna get it to work i don't this is so weird i've never had this problem happen before hold on let's just try this if i move over here is it there See if the menu is. Hmm. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. No. All right, video game. What's your problem?
My boss is always giving me these motivational sales books. They bought the farm, now sell them the cows. Stuff like that. What the hell? Yeah, it looks smooth for a bit, then gets choppy. It's, um... I'm trying to see if it's happening on my end or just yours. It's a deck of cards. Better take these cards. It looks like a long day of solitaire for me. It's just the stream. This deck of cards is a little frayed around the edges. Then again, so am I. And I've got fewer suits. <laughs> but it's... It's lagging my entire... Look. My stream is experiencing issues. I think the game is breaking my computer. Gotta switch to Resident Evil then? This deck of cards is a little frayed around the edges. Then again, so am I. Cursed and I've game. got fewer su Maybe. There's gotta be an option here that's breaking it. It's not that bad, it's just the menu. It's not just the menu. Oops. Um, It's slowing my entire computer. It's it's slowing me. Like it's slowing my uh everything. Let's see. This end cabin is where I hang my cloak. So Nothing in there but my cloak. Eh, I'm gonna let it air out some more. Not picking that up. See? If I'm in the menu. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. This deck of cards is a little frayed around the edges. Then again, so am I. And I've got fewer suits. Let's change the resolution. Let's do window. Maybe that'll fix it. And then... What? I'm not allowed to... Okay. Well, now I have to. God damn it. Hold on. But it doesn't recognize that it's a game. So I can't do that. <laughs> Hold on. God, this is so stupid. This is why I like streaming actual, like, heart. How do I explain this? Um. This is why I prefer streaming at um, actual hardware because PC games are such a fucking nightmare. I know you guys can't see this, by the way. I'm sorry. It's uh, it's not letting me show it. I literally can't change the resolution. I can either have windowed or not, which is a problem because I think it's because of the shape and size of my monitor. But Streamlabs doesn't think it's a game. Let's try this. Okay. This could have worked. Now. Can I go into my inventory without everything breaking? Ah! Did we fix it? I think we did. Now let me just steal this. Do you guys want to see these stupid borders? Because I can hide them, and we can go back to our other layout. Thwomp. Thwomp. I stole it. I'm bringing it over here. The hell? <laughs> Wait, hold on. There's something else in here. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh 
Hold on. Which one of these is real? Stop smoking. Look, we did it. Inventory? Laggy? Nope. Fixed! All right, we fucking did it. Sorry about that. It's fucking annoying, but it is what it is when we do the wheel in the morning. All right, can we touch this thing now? <laughs> Looks like I got a message. Oops. Uh, take? PC <laughs> raised some sort of special yeah. work order. To all agents from Office manager Don Copel. All right, you boneheads. Thank you, lucky stars, and get to your friggin' cars. We have a mass poisoning on our hands. Too many dead to assign specific cases, so all clients are first come, first serve. So let's see some hustle out there. Whatever you say, Iffy. Okay, so let's try this again. I'm... Is chat broken? What is that? I'm gonna throw myself into a lake. There's something there that's not supposed to be there. What is that? There it is. There we go. Nothing else is gonna break. So, Grim Fandango, we're playing this now. <laughs> Alright. Well, I can't guarantee it's in the right place. Because everything got touched, but I will turn it on for you. Oh god. Now chat is over her. <laughs> here we go. Cat. Here, enjoy. Jesus. We could leave it like that. That's pretty funny. All right, I'm trying again for the thousandth time. Grim Fandango, I don't know anything about this fucking game. I guess I do. Rain played it and I was kind of in the vicinity and he kind of assumed we had played together, but I didn't really pay attention. I know that there's some crazy puzzles. You solved the chat puzzle? Um, God, I'm so thrown off by how much everything broke. Anyway, um, it's definitely a point and click. And it seems like I'm a Grim Reaper, but I work for a boss, so I'm not a Grim, or I'm a Grim Reaper, not the Grim Reaper. And apparently a bunch of people just got poisoned. And I have a jacket button for going into my jacket. It's some sort of special work order. It's some sort of special work order. And it's voiced, which is nice. How many smokes has the game started? I don't know. This deck of cards is a little frayed around the edges. Then again, so am I. And I've got fewer suits. 
That's such a good bad joke. My message tube is full of nothing, as usual. My computer gives me instant access to our database of deadbeats. When people Oops. died with dignity, and Domino Hurley didn't exist. Ah, the old files, the old clients, the glory days. When people died with dignity, and Domino Hurley didn't exist. Domino Hurley, huh? What is this game about? I don't know. My We've boss has always given me these motivational sales books. They bought the farm, now sell them the cows. Stuff like that. Ugh. When I was a kid, I thought the skeletons were being poisoned. I had to solve the case. Warning, this game does not automatically save. Okay. I guess, so apparently there's a lot of bugs in this game as well. So we're just going to alternate between all the save spots they have. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we don't have to use the bugs emote too much, but we'll see. Hey, Hamster. Look. It's my boss's secretary, Ava. It's my boss's whipping boy, Manny. Hey. Buenos dias. Manny, why aren't you at the poisoning? Uh, what poisoning? What poisoning? The code three gazpacho poisoning that everybody's at, but you. Gazpacho. Why do I send out memos if nobody reads them? Where was the poisoning again? Just ask your driver for crying out loud. He'll know. We have a driver? Any messages for me? Besides the one about the poisoning? Yeah. I only have one other message for you, Manny. I'm not your secretary. I don't take your messages. So get it through your thick skull and stop forwarding your phone to me. All right. But that sounded more like four messages to me. I don't want to say this. Uh... Busy as ever, I see. I'd have more work to do if you had more clients. Ouch. Where is everybody? Oh, Manny, did you forget what day it is today? Oh, man, did I come in on Saturday again? It's the Day of the Dead. Everybody's back in the land of the living, visiting their families like we should be. Uh... Why aren't you visiting your family today? Ah, the boss is here, so I gotta be here. How about you, Cal? No one back there I want to see. And you don't want Domino here alone, getting all the good leads. Domino's here? He's at the poisoning right now, stealing your commission. So... You going to the Christmas party? After the spectacle you made of yourself last year? I wouldn't miss it for the world. I can't tell if my character is nice or not. <laughs> Day of the Dead, Disney tried to copyright that. Is that true that they tried to do that? I don't know if that's true. In my heart, though, you're still my secretary. Manny, what are you talking about? I was never your secretary, even when you were on top. I got one boss, same as you, Don Coppel. Okay, so I'm Manny. My boss is Don Copel. Come on, I know you work for another man besides Don. What? Well, what are you talking about? I know you take memos for Hurley sometimes. Ah, oh, Manny, just beat it, will ya? Any good gossip? Well, I heard Domino got a raise. Por favor, tell me some good news, why don't you? I still love you. You're all I really need, Bellissa. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, I forget. Am I supposed to be somewhere right now? Manny, do I have to explain your job to you again? Yes, please. Yes. Yes. Well, the Manuel <laughs> Calavera that I know picks up people in the land of the living. Dead people? Preferably. And he brings them here and tries valiantly to sell them the best travel package they qualify for. If he sells them enough premium packages, our hero will be free to leave the land of the dead. Oh. Until then, he and I are stuck here having the same conversation over and over again for eternity. That's interesting. Why do some clients qualify for better travel packages? They led good lives. Good tries. How do you define a good life? Better than yours and mine. <laughs> I don't know. By the way, I don't know any Spanish, so all of this is nonsense to me. Like, I know that it's less than zero. 
I wish we hadn't watched my cousin video already. Oh, uh, we could, well, we could watch it again. It's kind of like my cousin Vinny mixed with Beetlejuice so far. Well, enough about me. What's your job like? Like babysitting. Except I don't get to watch TV. What if we just skip town tonight? You and me, baby. Are we dating? Well, thanks for the offer, but we'd never make it out of the city alive. But... In one piece, I mean. I bet I could get you out if I really tried. Oh, Manny, look at you. You're a trapped soul and you don't even know it. So what did you do in life to get stuck here? What because I did back in the fat days is none of your business. Fat you days? You know the rules. Whoa. Okay. Just one more question about my job. Manny, you know what to do. Stop playing dumb just to flirt with me. Manny, if you don't mind, I've got a lot of filing here to do. Right. I do watch you. See ya, Penrose. I just got an achievement called What I Did Back in the Fat Days is None of Your Something. All right. Well, she doesn't like me. <laughs> Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. Boo. Okay, so I'm some dead guy. Oh, Rogue Cat, thank you for following. I'm some dead guy. Domino's door is locked. Probably scared I'll steal one of his files. Not a bad idea, actually. And I'm like an insurance salesman? So instead of being a normal Grim Reaper, I'm also an insurance salesman. Or like a travel salesman? This is so weird. It's a hole punch. It's my Can new. I take your hole punch? <laughs> I doubt you could take my half punch. <laughs> Damn it. All right. Well, are you sure? Can I take your hole punch? <laughs> I doubt you could take my half punch. It's a good joke. God, we haven't played a game like this in so fucking long. Uh, hold on, there was another door. I didn't know it was leaving. Why are there cars hanging on a thing? I say she likes you quite a bit to be so familiar. Maybe. The hell? I feel like you, uh, you can't really flirt with people you work with. That's kind of a big no-no. You hang up your cars so they don't get wrinkled? Oh. Let's see. Where am I on this? Don Copal, Domino Hurley, Junior Sales Associates. That better not be me. Okay. There she is. The number nine. One of these days, I'm going to ride her right on out of here. So that's like the quick way to get out? Ah, the old head of the department. Way before my time, I heard he was a total slave driver. It's locked. Are you terrified yet? Um, I'm a little confused. Why are we playing this? We could be in the middle of a 2000 hour JRPG again. Now this guy. I don't know who this guy is. I think he just paid for the lobby renovation. What? Ugh. Not that I have a choice, but I wonder if I'd be happier working on a ship. Then again, I'm so competitive, I wouldn't be able to relax until I was captain. Are you really that competitive? It's locked. I don't... How could he be a junior sales associate if he's that competitive? Oh. That's weird. I don't know why, but I thought it would be nighttime. I remember the year they built that. Mostly because it cost so much, we didn't get bonuses that year. Da caños. Hello, car. Oh, I sold so many car travel packages when I was first starting out. When did I lose my edge? Why can't I look no at this? No parking. Client car pickup only. It 
It may take 2,000 hours to solve some of these moon puzzles. We'll see, we'll see. Oh. We shall definitely see. These are horrifying. Birds. He walks so fucking slow. I bet I could figure out how to make him run. I should probably do that. Hello? Looks like some sort of crafty mine. <laughs> hey, what's going down, clown? Hey, back off, suit. I'm practicing. Practicing what? Ringing your neck. What does it look like? The voice acting in this is really good. The soundtrack of this game is excellent. Ah. Twist me up one of them, huh, fella? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twist this, all right? What? You're mean. Bet you can't do a cat. Shows what you know, buddy. I can do anything. That I looks like a worm. Birds, amphibians, famous poets. Go ahead. Name one. Uh. <laughs> Fuck! I really do want to do a dead worm, but there's no effort in that. There's no run button in Heart of Darkness. There's no word bossing say. I'm dying, please. I know I'm not good at finding run buttons. Uh, a dead worm. A dead worm. Heck, that's easy. There's no limit on those. <laughs> Thanks. Did you just give me a fucking- I don't got the lungs for it. Oh, I can't blow it. Put it in, I'll put it in my bag. I've got this sad. Deflated balloon. <laughs> you want to see Robert Frost? All right, let's see if we can get him to do another one. Uh, oh. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, uh, jeez. What now? Robert Frost. Robert Frost. Trying to stump me, eh? Ta-da! Wow, it's beautiful. I can wiggle it around. <laughs> Alright, that's mine now. Hey, can I have another one? He has. Alright, uh. Some festival, huh? Yeah, yeah, pretty busy. My carpal tunnel syndrome's really acting up. But you don't have any tendons. Yeah, well, you don't have a tongue. But that doesn't seem to shut you up, now does it? Could you teach me how to do that? He's well, mean. Uh, since you're a beginner, why don't you practice the first step? Which is? Blow! My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, uh, jeez. What now? Okay. A cat. <laughs> no problem. Ta-da! Huh. It's pretty good! Look at it! E -hee. Mine. I'm gonna float away. I'm gonna have a jacket full of balloons. My kid uh, wants another balloon in. I'm just gonna lie over Jeez, and over. What now? I'm glad I don't need to use money. A dingo? That's my specialty. Why is a dingo your specialty? What's a little tea? Ta-da! Thank you. This one's pretty good. Why do I have all these in my body? <laughs> this doesn't look anything like Robert Frost. <laughs> it's a squeaky little kitty. It's just a regular old balloon dog. I don't see what's so dingo about it. How did he get the teeth on there? <laughs> Why does it make a sound? It's a deflated balloon. It's a oh deflated God. balloon. To make balloon Robert Frost, does that mean the balloon has to live a life of horrible tragedy and masterful American poetry? Yes. I'm already terrified with the number of things that you put in your inventory. Me too. Bang! Ah, Pop another one. Oh, I just Lousy made birds fly away. Bony fingers. Can I walk through your tent? 
I want to see the parade. What if that was important? Walk through someone else's tent, all right? Do I look like a turnstile to you? I have to go. That sound makes me want to kill somebody. You too? Oh, God. All right. What? Where are you Those going? Those crates are completely blocking the sidewalk. What if there were a fire? I don't need the hernias. Okay, so he won't pick them up. I scared some birds away. Skeletons have a lot of room for things with their lack of organs. That's true. Why have intestines when I can just... Why can't you run? Oh, wait. If I double-click, he runs. All right, thank God. The petrified forest Rubakava. Not really that far away, but to me, they might as well be on the other side of the world. Not picking that up. I'm not walking on the freeway. I what? shouldn't even be standing here. Oops. I'm not walking on the freeway. I shouldn't even be standing here. I'm not telling you to do that. Go over here. Alright, well that's interesting. How does he make those without lungs? I don't know. Nothing matters. Nothing makes sense. Huh? Ooh. I don't like the way that eye is looking at me. Me either. Not picking that up. So... Hello? Oh. So that's like... It, uh, so I have like observe, try to pick up, and interact. Got it. Walking on the freeway so someone, someone could get killed? Oh, right. Oh, what is this? It looks like a rope, but it's really just a bunch of cheap ties tied together. Why am I doing this? This feels like a good way to die. <laughs> well, can we die though? Probably not. We're already dead. Well, that's weird. It looks like Don's rigged his computer to automatically answer his intercom. Okay, so he has it set to, didn't I say no interruptions today? Whatever it is, we'll have to wait. Can I go up? Aw, oh, cripes, Eva, just sign it yourself. Eva, please, a little time here. Tell me the checks aren't, tell them the checks aren't here yet. I'm on the phone. If you buzz my window again, I swear I'll jump out this window. I'll just go. change his auto response here. Ah, great, Ava. Just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy. This seems helpful. I feel like if I have it as that, I might be able to get away with something later. I need to like get my brain in the mindset of these games. Memo from the desk of Don Copal. Hey, work orders are assigned by my office and are not exchangeable among salesmen. Swapping, selling, and specially stealing work orders will result in severe disciplinary action. Hmm. This place is a mess. I would love to search Don's office right now, but I'm late for the poisoning. Oh, yeah. Just thinking about Don's file system gives me a cold chill. I would love to search Don's office. No time to ransack. Everybody's at the poisoning but me. Okay, so I can look at stuff, but I can't fuck around. I guess I'm going back out the window then. It's a little bird. Looks like the boss has gone fishing. What the hell does that sound? Looks like the boss has gone fishing. Hello? Uh huh. There's nobody in Domino's office. Domino locks his window. Fear of pigeons, probably. Fear of pigeons? Not picking that up. I 
wonder. This doesn't look anything like Robert Frost. I don't use items at things. Select. And that's how you try to use. Okay. Interesting. Wonder if I could use my scythe to get across. That's neat. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Hmm. I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to mess up my blade. Ah. Very weird. The aesthetics of this game, it looks so good. I did ask for a balloon animal of Robert Frost. I mean, why not? It gives me the option. Hello? So I wonder if I... I wonder how obtuse everything's gonna be. Use. Can I, like, pick it out? I don't want to mess up my blade. All right. What's happening? Why is he walking up again? My blade. I can't slice it. Slice. That soul has already been reaped. Huh? The hell does that mean? Oh my god, why are you sliding off the screen? I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> it's a deflated balloon. I think I'm balloon. supposed to use this. I don't got the lungs for it. Why? I don't got the lungs for it. Maybe I'm supposed to like pop the balloons near the birds at the top or something. Oops, I accidentally made the screen bigger. Fuck, hold on. I goddamn broke it. <laughs> we were doing so well. Get on the freeway. He doesn't have lungs. How's the other guy doing I'm it then? I'm not walking on the freeway. I shouldn't even be standing here. I'm not walking on the freeway. All I shouldn't right, even right. be standing here. Okay. Let's go back to the car park, I guess. That's the only other place I can think to go. That's not what balloons are for. Oops, sorry. Put that away. Go inside. Don't use a balloon on the door. Maybe this way? I think it was the elevator. No, it was over here. Hey, do you like balloon animals? She probably doesn't. Probably shouldn't harass her anymore. of the living okay that's where we need to go for the poisoning there are lights for wash rinse wax and land of the living depending on your destination the driver demons operate this somehow and the company won't tell a salesman how it works gotta oh. keep us down somehow well, that's weird okay I use deflated balloons to open doors every day. Here's what I need. Wheels. Ooh, I might get hurt if I try to get one down by myself. Okay. All right, I'm gonna double click. It's a tool cabinet. With tools? Locked. Damn it! Hey, who the who oh. that with my stuff? Oh, sorry, sir. I didn't expect sales agents usually don't come over to this part of the garage. What the fuck are you? What? 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 Okay. Kind of looks like a character from Arthur. Uh. I'm Calavera. 
Manny Calavera. My name's Gladys. I don't get many visitors. Hey, I got a message for a Mr. Calavera. Uh, your driver said that Mr. Hurley said that he could have the rest of the day off. Domino sent my driver home? Yeah, what? wasn't that nice? God damn it. All right, Gladys is a gross f <laughs> fucking name for someone to have. I'll see you, Rogue Worker. Okay? Them teeths? He mappy. It's Arthur? This is Arthur when he grows up. Hey, you a driver? Me? Ha! No. No, oh, no. Why is he I don't ride Just wrench him. Gladys. Gladys. Is that a German name? Oh, no. My roots lie not in any earthly nation's soil. I am an elemental spirit summoned up from the land of the dead itself and given one purpose, one skill, one desire to drive or to change oil and adjust timing belts if no driving jobs are open. <laughs> A driving spirit? Okay. Uh. Nice hut. Yeah, I wonder how nice it would seem to you if you were trapped in it all day like me. If you hate your job, why don't you quit? It's not just a job. It's what I was created to do. If I get any farther away from cars than this, I'll get sick and die. It's what? Like I'm not happy unless I'm breathing in the thick black nauseating fumes <sighs> hmm can't imagine okay dies if away from cars looks like i need a new driver oh i uh i uh i would agree with that yes you do you want to be my replacement driver me oh Oh, no. Sorry. Can't. Rules. I'm gonna get this guy killed. Come on, Gladys. I need you to be my driver. No, I can't. I'm... I'm... I'm too big. What? <laughs> you're not too big. You're, you're just right. You have a self-image problem where the cars are just too small. The cars are too small. You're not too big. The cars are just too small. Yeah, those dang compact cars. Hey, that gives me an idea. I could alter your car just a bit with just a quick torch job to let out the seams, Wait. you know? I'll, I'm not allowed to modify the cars without a work order from upstairs. I could lose <gasps> my job. A work order, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't torch anything bigger than a cigarette without one of these signed by the boss himself. Hey, hey, hey. that's my line. I can do this. Getting people to sign. Back in a snap. Yeah, too small. I'm not too big. Everything around here is just too small. Yeah, honey, it's... That's definitely the case. Okay, all right, okay, all right. Um, so... I know exactly what to do. That won't help it get signed. Oh, fuck. That away. Who's afraid of a little rusty water? <laughs> hey, Maddie! Did you get that work order signed yet? No. no. Can we just do it without? I told you I could lose my job. Manny, if I lose my job. Hey, hey, hey don't worry. Just go on back to work. All right. Somehow. Okay, all right. I know what to do. We already um we already changed the the automated message thing to be like, "Hey, sign it yourself," which is perfect. Good job, foresight. All right. So, we just need to go bother her and then if we're like, hey, go ask him, maybe she'll just sign it it's for locked. us. That should be fine. I feel like I'm doing everything backwards, but whatever. Uh, walk up here, please. Faster, faster. Talk. Uh. Oh, I don't want to say this. If I really need the boss to sign this work order, I'll give it a shot. I have not played the snow. Rain Mr. played Copel, it though. Mr. Calavera has something out here that he says he needs your signature on. 
Oh, great, Diva. Just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy. Hmm. You'll have to excuse him, Manny. It's probably a really hard crosswood puzzle he's got in there today. Eva, I'm impressed. I had no idea you had this kind of power. Well, we all have our secrets. I've not played this. Uh, Rain played this, though. Uh, Way of the Dre, thank you for following. Oh, it just automatically did it. Okay. I can't believe he wears lifts. <laughs> Uh-oh. Hey, I look good in this, don't I? <laughs> yeah, well, they say black is slimming. I'm driving, yeah! I'm driving! Okay, that may have been the wrong thing to do. I could have walked faster than this. Ugh, híjole, I'm gonna miss the poisoning. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Is that a human man? Domino. Ah, uh, okay, so that's my rival. Ugh, the living still give me the creeps. Oh, oh. Oh, maybe this is our harvester this year. Hello. What are Uh Look at these poor saps. It's the fear of death that makes monsters of us all. Smiles as bright and wide as the blade on my scythe. Soon I'll be coming for them. Scaring the living is technically against the rules, but we all do it. Oh, I'm scaring them? Oops. Uh... Truth be told. I'd rather be setting this milkshake soul free. It's mine now. Can't reap the milkshake. Can only smell it. Damn it. Mmm. Smells like the perfect client. Rich and sweet. Okay. All right, wiggly thing. Bound only by the paper-thin wrapper of mortality, a soul here lies, struggling to be free. And so it shall, thanks to a bowl of bad gazpacho and a man named... Calavera. I can't carry the whole package out of here. He's got to shuffle off his mortal coil. Then we can split. Okay. I can't use my bare hands. I'm oh. A professional. Right. I have to scythe him. Scythe. Slice. Oh, you're little. Hello. Nice bathroom. Huh? I don't know what's going on ever. But we offer several travel package upgrades if you'd care to cut the yeah. I want something cheap where I can get some rest. Now that's it. Ay, ay, ay. You know, Manny, I could make this car a little faster. If you wanted. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Oh yeah, slam the front into the weeds. Tub the rear end. Two blowers popping out of the hood. Uh oh. <laughs> You'll get plenty oh, of rest no. this way, Mr. Martinez, and you'll be safely padded by the foam created when these two chemicals mix like this. Oh, on second thought, I want to upgrade my package. Sorry, Bruno, but you didn't qualify for anything better. But here, have this complimentary mug. <laughs> no, wait! Uh, can't you find me something where I can move my legs? You know I'd like to, Bruno, but my boss is a real hard ass. I gotta be a hard ass when I got lazy sickle waivers like this jolly boy working for me. Manny, you couldn't find a sale at a yacht club. I got a sale right here. 
I'm talking premium sales, Calavera. Like the kind Domino makes. How am I supposed to make premium sales with the scumbag clients you're sending me? Hey! Now you're blaming the clients? I've had it with you, Manny. If you haven't bagged a premium before the next sales report comes in, you're out! Out on the street! No job! No way to work off your time! Just your fancy suit and your big smile and a whole lot of time to kill! Who you calling a scumbag? Why well, I oughta- Foam him. Thank you. <laughs> Sick of waiting around for a good lead. Like it's gonna fly in here tied to a brick. It's time to take one. We're gonna get in trouble. I'm gonna get myself fired. Then we're gonna die. Wa 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 wa. Actually, save often, right? Hey. Give me a good thing. It's a hole punch. Oh, oops. Give me. Could I take your hole punch? Ha! <laughs> I doubt you could take my half punch. Damn it. All right. What is that horrible squeaking noise you're making? Oh, I'm Shoot. full of balloons. Um. <laughs> hey, you missed a great poisoning. Yeah, and you missed a great client. Domino came back from there with a nun. Damn Damn it. It. I got a tiny little man with a mean temper and no commission. Well, at least you don't work for one. You know, Copal's not really in his office. Sweetheart, I know what you're up to. Huh? You're trying to get me away from my desk so you can link all my paper clips together again. Grow up, darling. Okay, I like our character. He sounds fun. <laughs> uh, God is monsterette. Hello, welcome. He's already dead, though. Everybody's already dead, mostly. I can't find my driver. Manny, you know what to do. Stop playing dumb just to flirt with me. Manny, if you don't mind, I've got a lot of filing here to do. Damn right. I do watch you. All right. Can you talk to my shitty boss? Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. <sighs> do you want a balloon animal? I'll give you this cat. Oh, that's what's making that terrible noise. It's true. It's me. Oh, this fucker's here. I should probably put this balloon animal away. Hold on. What is he doing? It's Domino Hurley, the sweatiest man in the office. <laughs> you gotta sweat the cell, Callie, and you know it. Oh, God. Well, at least you're not hitting the bottle anymore. Hey, hey Callie, how Whoa. you doing? Oh, I will do pets, gladly. Okay. What the fuck was that sound? Big baby. She's somehow a real animal. <laughs> yeah, somehow indeed. All right, how much time do you have on that? All right, we're good. It's done. Say goodbye. I have to hydrate, but my water is in another room. Love that good cat. Good. All right. Uh, so, how'd you make out of the poisoning? Well, let's just say that Sister Calabaza has a secret passion. Huh? For trains. You got a nun? Hail Mary. And you sold her a ticket on the number nine train. Choo-choo, little buddy. But I don't understand what the say, currency how'd is. how'd you score? Uh... None of your business, Hurley. You're right. <laughs> what went on between you and, uh... Bruno is your business. Damn it. He already knows. All right, all right. I'll go get a drink. You guys have to listen to this punching, though. I'll be right back.
I just saw a man walking in front of my house, walking a dog and eating a banana, and it was very joyful. I have two hydrates to do. One. Two. Thank you. Do you have cat hair all over the place? Our long hair basically carpets our house. Uh, yeah, I have to vacuum a lot. It sucks. Uh, but it's not that bad. I've definitely had cats that were more sheddy, but at the very least, she's hypoallergenic. She has, like, weird fur. I want to ask you a question. Shoot, slugger. <laughs> <clears throat> well, I feel like I shouldn't say a lot of these. Uh, Why do you get all the good clients? You're asking the wrong guy. You should be taking a good long look at the man in the mirror. No, thanks. I don't enjoy that the same way you do. What did you do to get this job? You mean, what's my secret to success? No, I mean, how did you screw up and get stuck here at the DOD? What sin did you commit, and how long are you going to have to work here to pay oh, it off? So I well, I could sin. easily ask the same question of you, but I don't know the answer. I still don't know what I've done. Well, Wait, how what? convenient. Then, uh, neither do I. That's weird. Can I have one of your clients? Sure, Cal. Just as soon as I get one I think you could handle, I can handle anything you got. Especially oh, if that's your best right jab. Should I, should I say this one? It feels kind of fucked up. I can't... I don't know if there's like a morality system or something. It feels like there will be because we're in the afterlife and it seems like I'm here because I did some type of horrible thing during my normal life and now... I'm not allowed to go somewhere? Oh, fuck, I don't know. All right. Is it hard to kiss up to the boss so much when you got no lips? Hey, I got all the lip I need. I get it from you. What a good fucking comeback. Well, see you in limbo. Oh, Damn that's it. great. We should do this more often. God <laughs> It's one of those games where I think I'm supposed to do everything, but if I do everything, I might like fuck up. I don't know. The hell's on your ceiling, dude? Oh. That's some premium looking scotch. Have some, Manny. Just so you don't forget what premium tastes like. Oh, you son of a bitch. Give me that. Wait, how do I taste things? Give me that. No, I want to pick it up, not drink it. All right. Well, I've had two alcohols now. Desk drawers? I don't have desk drawers. <laughs> hey, get out of there, Calavera. Hey, Dom. What's your screensaver password? Get away from my computer, Manny. Him laughing like that was actually pretty good. Hey, Dom. Get away from my... The voice acting's too good. No messages in Dom's fancy red tube. He's got a lock on it. I can't believe he doesn't trust me. <laughs> He shouldn't. I'm definitely going to steal all this shit. You know better than to ask for logic in a game like this. It hasn't been too bad so far. Granted, we haven't really done much. Oh, hello. What's up? Go faster. No, over there. Oh my god. Computer. I don't have drawers. My computer gives me instant access to our database of deadbeats. Your favorite skeleton gag is when they eat, drink something, and then it falls out of them. It's a classic. Do you think I just poured, like, alcohol over his floor? What does my computer do? I should close Bruno's record before the black marks burn into my screen. Ah, cool. Did I do it? I should close. Okay, no. I like his little typey fingers. My message tube is full of nothing, as usual. One of the characters in this game is voiced by Hawk Girl from. Oh, the Justice League cartoon. Cool. Oh, can I put a bit of balloon in here? Hold on. I feel like I'm. There's a lot of crimes I could be committing. Where's my worm? Oh, fuck. Right, it's the little shriveled one. It's a deflated balloon. Maybe I can put this in there? That's not what balloons are for. Damn it. That's I mean, not what balloons are for. It could be. You don't know. Ah, 
Huh, he didn't say that's not what balloons are for in that one. How about the cat? Cat. <laughs> All right, maybe not. You probably just ruined the inside of your suit. I probably did. <laughs> okay, all right, fine. I definitely feel like I'm supposed to shove something in here. A deck of cards just wouldn't help there. That's what you think. Put them away. I think our driver might have done some horrible things. Maybe I can give him a balloon animal. Hey, I'm gonna give you a little deflated worm balloon, okay? Look at this. That's not what balloons are for. Oh man! What about this one? <laughs> Look at my balloon! Hmm. Uh, she doesn't want to talk to me anymore, I don't think. Oh, wait, no. I want to go down and see if the driver fucked up our car anymore. The balloon wiggle is kind of amazing. If you had hair, it'd probably be staticky. You're right. Maybe I can just leave. Sign says, I'm at the junkyard. Woo! <laughs> okay. No one in there. Not when there's a door. Hmm. It's still locked. It's a tool cabinet. It's locked. Damn it. I like that they commit on the wooing. Maybe we go outside. Maybe it's fine out there now. I see you got the best balloons, the dead worm and Robert Frost. This is a, uh, I don't know. I, I don't know if this is gonna turn out to be like super creepy yet or if it's gonna be totally fine because there have definitely been some creepy fucking moments. You and your fancy suits and your nose holes way up in the air, sticking your empty beer bottles down the message tubes. How fancy is that, huh? Don't you boys upstairs realize the tube switcher is a sophisticated and delicate piece of machinery? Huh? You think you're better than me? No. Good. Beer bottle and a tube switcher. I did try to put things in there, but I definitely didn't do that. Oh! It's the sophisticated and delicate hub of all communications here in the Department of Death. Oh, Department of Death, DOD. Oh, that's funny. All right. As a rule, I never touch anything more sophisticated and delicate than myself. Not picking that up. Warning, fire system, do not touch. Touch. That's mine now. That wheel should open it. I love these games because they always let you fucking steal stuff. The wheel won't turn and the door won't budge. But what if a balloon cat? Okay. All right, well, I stole the fire extinguisher. It's just like when I was a kid and I uh, played my brother's, um, my brother's game where I could steal everything. Oh, Malislas, thank you for the read. Welcome, welcome. Just stole the fire extinguisher when the machine burns to flames, that'll be important. Maybe. Warning, fire system, do not touch. Touch. 
Uh, the Ultima. The, there was an Ultima game. Ultima the False Prophet. I used to sign into his game and run around and steal things and then turn it off. It was fun. That's the only thing I like about the Ultima games is that you can take everything not nailed down. Yeah, it was great. I stole so much cheese and potions from people's desks. Hey, do you want a fire extinguisher, weirdo? Oh, I guess not. I have you. Those crates are completely blocking the sidewalk. Maybe I can hand him this? That's not what balloons are for. Maybe I could use the fire extinguisher to break into his office from like above. I feel like I already. Oh, wait. What about this, though? Do you want this? That's not what balloons are for. That's what you think. <laughs> this fucking noise. Hi, yeah. That's not on fire. It's not on fire. Okay, so I'm supposed to use on something on fire. I guess that makes sense, though. Would you like a card in your eye? A deck of cards just wouldn't help there. How goes the grimmest of reapers? We just just started. It's fine so far. I feel like I might be dumb, though. Ultimate adds morality because everyone played as a kleptomaniac. I think that's cool. I didn't know that until like last year and I thought it was pretty neat. Warning. Fire system. Do not touch. It's locked. What's locked now? That's not on fire. Oops. That's not on fire. All this the stuff grapes is are drawn. Dom must be in there napping. No use for it. What's that sound? No, Domino's in there. Domino's in there. Not while Domino's in there. Not while no he's in way. there, huh? If I go any farther, Dom will see me and call the staff shrink to come and talk me down. <laughs> okay. Maybe I'm supposed to insult him, insult him more. This just makes too much sense for an adventure game. Everyone steals in the Ultima games, Lord British. But I didn't intend. Ah, shit creates morality system. Ugh. Lord British. Of course, Richard also added a way to kill kids in every game for some reason, too. There's a lot of weird stuff in those games that I've heard about. We should really play one or two, but I've heard they're much better on computer than they are on um, console. I sold so many car travel packages when I was first starting out. My kid died. More worms. Give me more dead wells. Thanks. Okay, do I have two worms now? Use this for something. I don't got the lungs for it. Interesting. The Sega Master System for oh god, if I could get a fucking master system though. That'd be pretty cool. I joy that the opening gag is that a walking cane is a travel package, so it's pretty good. I wish I hadn't been distracted by the weird stuff going on. Whoa, what the fuck is in here? For those who enjoy no hassle travel, 
Oh, this is where we were. Bruno, you in one of these? Must have picked them up already. One of the chemicals for our packing material comes out of there. Oh! I bet I can fill a balloon with this stuff. One of the chemicals for our packing material comes out of there. Aha! Wait, what? Oh, I had two of them. Where'd it go? Here it is. This balloon is filled with a light chemical. Oh my god, if I put that in the thing, is it gonna blow it up? I feel like that's a crime. Let's try it. I feel kind of bad. I, I didn't realize this were open. No, walk this way. I feel like that's a crime. Let's try it. Okay, come on. Why did you all have to say it? You didn't all have to do it. All right. Uh, tube. Oh my god, and I took the fire extinguisher. So if it explodes, they're not gonna be able to put it out. I'm a, gonna be a murderer. Fuck! What am I doing? Look out below. Okay. Maybe I fill up another one with the other stuff? Maybe I should go check the room. I feel bad because that guy was just like super fucking pissed about what happened. How's it going in here? There's that light chemical all over in there. As a rule, I never touch okay. anything more sophisticated I think I have to do the and other delicate one. than myself. I did the one on the leftish. I just doing the one on the rightish. Oh, well, at least I get another balloon. All right. Um... Red. If this reacts in there, it could be really good for us, but I don't know what it will cause. All I know is that I can't progress unless I cause trouble, so... Can you blame me or should you blame the game? And the answer is you should blame the game. It's not my fault. Don't worry. You're only doing this because you know you're better than him. No. All right. Uh, fuck. All right. Such a bad sound. That doesn't sound good. Time to go check it out. You didn't hear anything, did you? Server's down again. What else is new? Oh. Manny, if you don't mind, I've got a lot of filing here to do. Right. I do watch you. Server, huh? Haha, -ha, why would that have happened? Certainly I don't know. Crimes with the Call is a hot new series on Twitch.tv. Thanks. That's it. Hey. Going on over here. That red tube looks familiar. Ah, our cheerful communications maintenance staff is on the job. 
he's gonna yell at me. Hi, I'm not getting any messages. Is the server down? This is their idea of a joke? They think it's funny? I'd like to jab their tubes with packing material. See how they like that. Who would do a terrible thing like this? It's so, those punks in the mailroom. They think this baby is going to put them out of a job. And they're right. Uh, Can I squeeze in there just for a sec? Are you kidding? This is a highly secured area. No one's allowed in here who ain't me. Fuck. What's so special about you? I, sir, am an elemental spirit. Summoned from the land of the dead itself. They're also yeah, lucky. Yeah, let me guess. You were given one purpose, one skill, one desire. Fixing pneumatic tube switchers. No, I was created to run the elevators, but they put in those dang motion detectors and put me out of work. Oh. So you're saying the server is down, is that it? The server is not down. It's never down. It's just temporarily unavailable while I'm doing some maintenance, that's all. So how long is it gonna be down? With a job like this, you can never tell. Probably hours. Or until no one's around to see you sneak out, eh? Whichever comes first. <laughs> you know, I really think it's clean enough. Oh, it's clean enough to run all right. I'm just fiddling around to be safe. You know, gotta cover my ass. Yes, you do. Just curious. How'd you get in there? I squeezed down one of these tubes like a pixie. How do you think I got in here? Through the door, just like you. Say, uh, chatty coffee. I got a lot of tubes to flush here. Hey, me too. I'll let you go. I've got to get to this red tube somehow. Ugh. Oh, not again. Oh. Ah, 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 ah. You trying to blow this joint sky high? That's a magnesium compound fire extinguisher. Spray that on this packing foam, and we'll both be riding the giant Roman candle out of here. What? Why would they put something so dangerous in here? I guess they didn't expect this room to be full of hazardous waste. That's not on fire. That's not on fire. Damn it! I was gonna try to kill us. Ah, a cheerful community. Hey, I'm still not getting any message. I'm giving you one right now, but you can't see my hand. The dead bull looks like it's not set. I've just locked an open door. Strange, yet symbolically compelling. Close it. Not picking that up. The wheel won't budge. As a rule, I never touch anything more sophisticated and delicate than myself. Hmm. Eh? Good enough for government work. <gasps> it shouldn't close now. I was thinking I was going to try to make sure he didn't die in there. Okay, I should be able to go in now. Also, good enough for government work is a great fucking joke. Hello. Alright, you fucker. I think that's the other end of Domino's message, too. Not anymore. I could just get in there. I could just get in there? It's locked. Why is it locked? Not to a cat! Hiya! Well. 
What if I blow everything up? That's not on fire. Why do I feel like that fire message is gonna be really important later? Oh! Aha! Oh hmm. no. Too much air pressure. Too much air pressure. Can I block it? Okay, so the card thing kind of did something. garbage. Maybe we could try it. It might kill us though, but we'll see. Why not? <laughs> I don't know why, but saying what a crazy random thing to happen is really funny to me. My kid, uh, one time. Gimme. Worm. Any more? Well. Thank you. Alright. We're gonna fill it with stuff and we're gonna shove it in there. And see what happens. Maybe it'll just fuck up his That's desk. Not what balloons are for. Oh, get in the door. Oh my god, we are so close to getting the fucking costume challenge done. Cosmo is so close! Just wait. I think you guys are really gonna freak out when you see what the next one is. Alright, let's try this. No, go inside. pressure to put a card in, but it did kind of work. Hmm. Too much air pressure. Oh, can I do something in the It's the part? sophisticated and delicate hub of all communications here in the Department of Death. As a rule, I never touch anything more sophisticated and delicate than myself. I want it to be working because I want to steal his commissions. <laughs> Too much airflow. Can I have this hole punch now? Money for knock is. Oh! Thanks. Gets the aggressions out, doesn't it? I have to hole punch the card. Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. Okay. I couldn't play this card there. So that should let the wind go through. No, I'm going out. I don't want to go out. Go back inside. Okay, now we should be able to block the tube without it getting pushed through. No, go inside. What's wrong with you? Thank you. Alright. Time reading stories to dying children. 
And that's good. That's really good. I think you're with me, Mercedes Colomar. I think you're the one for me. Mine! Oh. Gladys, are you loco? What got into you? That was a company car. Oh, yeah. And it's even better company now. I'm in. Oh my god, what have I done? Uh, Jessica Flora, thank you for following. Welcome. Oh. Buenos dias. You're not the nurse? Why do you have eyelashes? Whatever. No. You're not here to give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. Guess they couldn't save me, huh? No. But there's still a chance you could save me. That's a lot of responsibility, Mr. Calavera. What makes you think I've been all that good? Miss Colomar. Meche, please. Meche. I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled to a first class ticket to. Nowhere? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. Oh, are you like a crime lord and I accidentally am stuck with you? It's the eyelash bones? Oh, duh, I should have known. Are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? Yes. Would you like to see my birthmark? Sure. Where is it? It's wherever you guys put my skin. All right, I fell for that one. <laughs> Anything about your past you haven't told me? Quite a bit, considering I've told you nothing. Oh, well, uh... Did you kill much when you were alive? Very little. <laughs> never killed anybody? I have to confess, I never killed anybody. <laughs> Not even a teensy bit of killing? Maybe I just wasn't trying hard enough. <laughs> Were you a big shoplifter? Well, they accused me of it once. Really? But it wasn't my fault. That puppy followed me out of the store. Oh. Mean to animals? Oh, no. I love animals. Once, when I was volunteering at an animal shelter, I... Just stop right there. Ever cheated on your taxes? I've never paid taxes in my life. Aha. Uh -huh. I've never made enough money to be taxed. You know, it's mostly been all volunteer work. Uh-huh. Are you kidding me? Ever cheated on your husband? Mr. Calavera, there's no ring on my finger. There's no skin on it either. I guess you'll <laughs> just have to trust me then. Litter? Oh, Manny, is that the best you can do? Work with me, Meche. Give me some dirt. Well, I could do something bad right now, if that would help. Wouldn't count. Sorry, I give up. Don't say that, Manny. Excuse me, but I have to go straighten this mess out. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Calavera. It's no trouble, but please, call me Manny. This is just skeleton good place? It is. How is cheating on taxes a sin? <sighs> be taxes themselves are sin. Okay, well, fuck. Can we, like, My look at our file? My computer gives me instant access to our database Shut of up. deadbeats. Shut up and use it. What's wrong with her? I just don't understand it. Why can't I find anything good for Mechi? Maybe it's my computer. Maybe my computer is bugged. So that I, I no matter what, I can't do anything good. I don't want to reread the old files. It'll just make me sad. I'm still on the case, Michi, but I haven't found anything for you yet. Maybe I'm not the woman you were hoping for. She looks fine to me. Hmm. That's really weird. Maybe we can ask, um... I'm sorry I let you down, Manny. Oh. Well, I guess this is our fault for stealing a client. 
Hey, help. Oh! Hey, funny bones! In my office! Now! You vandalized company property. How do they know? Secret information so you could take your illegally modified company car and your unregistered driver and run Domino here off the road. All in order to steal a client from her legitimate agent. There's nothing legitimate about this place. You give all the good clients to Domino. Manny, now I'm embarrassed for you. You've embarrassed the whole office. I'm going to call the woman in here so you can apologize to her yourself. Ava, send in Ms. Colomar, please. She left about 15 minutes ago, sir. She said she had a long walk ahead of her and she wanted to get started. Walking? She had a ticket on the number nine. Why does she think she has to walk? That's the best package I could find for her. <laughs> now you see why I give all the good clients the domino. That woman was a saint and a shoe in for there a is something wrong ticket here. that she's not going to get because you just couldn't find it. And now, because of your little stunt, she's out there, on her own, walking by herself through the petrified forest, facing the demons of the underworld, alone and unprotected. This is her reward after a lifetime of hardship and public service? Her destiny stolen by some overreaching salesman looking for a fat commission he didn't deserve. Get in there and stay put until the boys downtown tell us what they want done with you. Someone's gonna take the fall for this, Calavera, and it ain't gonna be me! Oops. Okay, well, to be fair, there's no reason why my computer shouldn't let me do stuff, and it's probably his fault. But I do feel kind of bad. Technically, all the actors have skeletons, so the good place is already a skeleton good place. Well, it but. looks like it dispenses something called philodent. Ugh. Ooh, ick. It came out like soft serve ice cream, but judging by the smell, I think it's auto body filler. Ugh. Is it locked? Hey, is anybody out there? So, Manuel. Have you thought about what you have done? What? Who's out there? I'm you. Or rather, I was you years ago. Yeah, well, I'm me now, so get lost. What are they gonna do to me? I don't want to alarm you, Agent Calavera, but have you ever seen a man sprout it? What do you mean, sprout it? Then you don't know. There's nothing more horrible than the bite of the sprouter. Its deadly stinger spreads a green disease through every calcified pore on your body, leaving you veined with roots and flocked with grass, what steadily growing thicker and thicker until you crash and bloom out in a horrifying bouquet of pain and fragrant suffering, screaming until your mouth fills with petals and your nostrils shoot out thorny stems, and the bulbs sprout in your eyes, leaving you nothing but a patch of wildflowers on the ground swarming mean with butterflies are you done yes this doesn't sound no, so I've bad i've never seen that <laughs> no i've never seen that um get me out of here the only way out manuel is to be taken back in if you are truly still loyal to this company declare it loudly the management might hear and stick you right back in their fold This one. The DOD runs a crooked game, and I intend to prove it. You would do that? That could cause this agency a lot of trouble. I'm gonna blow the lid off this place. I wonder if get killed. You are an enemy of the Department of Death. Welcome to the club. What? Salvador Limones and guest. Where are you taking me? What's happening? To the headquarters of the LSA. LSA? The Lost Souls Alliance. We're a small group, Manuel. We're always looking for new soldiers. Uh... To do what exactly? We need help in our intelligence unit. You know Eva, of course. Manny? I was once Wait, a... Wait, what? Yourself, Manny. But I uncovered a web of corruption in our beloved Department of Death. I have reason to believe that the Bureau of Acquisitions is cheating the very souls it was chartered to serve. I think someone is 
robbing these poor, naive souls of their rightful destinies, leaving them no option but to march on a treacherous trail of tears, unprotected and alone, like babies, Manuel, like babies. <laughs> What's your evidence? That's where you come in, Manuel. Or should I call you Agent Calavera? Manny suits me fine. I'm not looking to join any military organization, Sal. I just want my job back so I can work off my time and get out of this dump. Well, you won't even be able to get out of this city without my help. Which means, of course, you won't be able to find that woman and you'll never get your job back. When you're ready to join the cause, Manuel, come talk to me. We might be of some use to each other. Okay. Well, that's weird. Do I have more saves? Yes. Uh, Kato96, thank you for following. Welcome. Or Kaito. Hey, Car, remember that time you meddled in the delicate process of the afterlife? I doomed a poor, kind woman to an eternity of wandering this unforgiving hell. Haha, ha, doofus. Thanks. Jailed for skeleton crimes. Uh, well, that was weird. What's this? What the fuck is that? Where does this go? To a secret tunnel out of the city, but it opens for members of the LSA only. So I could leave. Open it. It Open won't it. budge. It opens for members of the LSA only. So f this fucking lady's down here. It's my boss's secretary's evil twin. Just me, honey. <laughs> so you're not really a secretary. I'm a spy, Manny. Okay. Well, that's the last time we use that temp agency. Oh shit, we did it! Yay! Look at that. Challenge complete. Costume up. All right, that means on the 29th, which is next Friday, not tomorrow, but next Friday, Rin and I are going to be in costume for our co-op night. Guess what? Now I can do the next one. <laughs> My TV's upside down. All right, get ready. Here comes the next one. This is the last one. This is the final Halloween challenge. You're ready for this because it's gonna be bonkers. Hold on, I gotta count days. <laughs> You'll probably get it beforehand, but just in case. for this. Your channel points aren't ready. Hey, this is the one type of time of year. That's right. The new challenge is hot dog cat. We're going to be if 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 you meet this before the 29th, we are going to be dressing Octavia up as hot dog link. Please, please look forward to it. <laughs> you have no, you have zero channel points. Don't worry, you have nine days. It'll be okay. All right, I believe in you. Any messages for me? Yes, join or die. But I'm already- Again. What? Oh, what's this? A pet? I can do that. I see you want some pets? She's upside down right now. I gotta get this fucking shit to load. Thank you, Zarin. Swamp. Just wait. Don't you want to see her dressed as our son, who is... <sighs> right there? <laughs> She's gonna be so mad. 
I mean, maybe. Maybe she'll love it. What if she wants to be Hot Dog Link? Huh? Did you think of that? Maybe she wants to be a hot dog. Want to be a hot dog, honey? For clarification, hot dog equals... Uh, hot dog equals... What I was last Halloween. Good baby. I feel bad about contributing to something that's gonna get me killed, but I do want to see Hot Dog Octavia if she ever replays. <laughs> Even if she repays Carcola with Claudia Death, she won't. She doesn't scratch. <laughs> All right. Anyway, please enjoy. That's the final Halloween challenge. You guys have totally smashed it this year. Ava, you gotta get me out of town. They're gonna sprout me. You can't leave, Manny. We need access to the DOD computer network if we're ever gonna find out what's going on. And we can't access without a salesman like you. The oh. computer IDs you when you log on. How does it do that? Fingerprints? I don't have any. Your teeth, Manny. Haven't you ever noticed your computer scanning your teeth when you log on? I thought that was just a power search. We need your teeth, Manny. We can't let you go. Sorry. Well, that's creepy. I'd have all my points in if I could. You were snossage last Halloween? I was, I was hot dog. How long have you been a spy? Salvador recruited me about a year ago. I couldn't resist him. He's just so noble. Hmm. What are you working on there? I'm trying to get this radio working so we can use it in the field. But it looks pretty hopeless. Salvador is right. We need good old-fashioned homing pigeons to communicate with our field agents. You have field agents? No, it's just Sal and me right now. But someday, Manny. Doesn't Kapal wonder where you are? Don and Domino are both locked up in Don's office with some bigwig from downtown. Some fatty in a fez. Hmm. Who is the fat man, I wonder? And how does he fit into this sinister puzzle? What are you doing? So, you won't help me out of here. Sorry. I'll help you out, but not your teeth. Think it over. Okay. How can skeletons have boobs? She's probably just wearing, um... She's probably just wearing a bra out of habit. Though if I were a skeleton, I would not. Salvador seems to be concentrating. Do you know something I don't know? Have you ever wondered why your clients, even your best clients, never seem to qualify for the packages yes. you know they deserve? Yes. My last client in particular, Mechi. Well, they all did qualify, Manuel. Especially her. But somehow, somebody with access to the files has stolen their just rewards. Their sweet hereafters. Their tickets on the number nine? Precisamente, amigo. What would they do with the tickets? A ticket on the number nine is like a leaf of gold, Manuel. Especially to one who has died with a less than perfect record. Someone is profiting here from those that would buy their way into heaven. But money's not important here. We all just want out. You want to get out, Manuel. And so do I someday. But for some people, this world is all there is. They have decided to seek pleasure and happiness here in the eighth underworld. And for that, you need money. What do you want from me? I'm going to build an underground army of souls to fight the injustice I have seen in El Marro. Communication will become vital as El the Lost Ma Souls uh. Alliance spreads out. We'll need messengers we can trust. You want me to be your messenger? No, Manuel. Our numbers are small and our agents are too valuable to risk that sort of work. History shows only one messenger to be of use to a cause like ours. Carry your pigeons. Carrier pigeons. Why the fuck would... Okay. If I grab some pigeons off the roof, will you let me go? No. I need to raise them from birth, Agent Calavera. I need you to bring me their eggs. What? 
You're keeping me here because you need the eggs? Why are you still here, Calavera? Go get me an Air Force before it hatches. Now that's all the briefing you need, soldier. Viva la revolución! Uh... Okay. I don't get it. Nor do I, Manuel. Not yet. So these are pigeons. I'd put on a hand shadow show, but the mood just doesn't feel right. It's a slide projector. Manuel, I was looking at that. Sorry. Well, that's fucking weird. This computer <laughs> shut off. We salvaged that unit when the company threw it away. But we have yet to get it working. When we do, we'll need you to get us into the system. I'll be long gone before then. We'll see, Manuel. This computer shut off. Hmm. Well, this all seems like a fucking mess. So I need to go steal bird eggs? Okay. I'm... I'm gonna take a quick break. <laughs> I'm gonna take my lunch now. I have a lot to think about. So this game is... This game... Uh, Gray they thank you for following. Welcome. So... This is very interesting. Stealing bird eggs, what a foul crime. God damn it. How, what do you think? Listen to the music out here? Are they gonna play any? Yeah, all right. I'll, uh, I'm gonna go eat something really quick. And then I'm gonna steal pigeon eggs, I guess. Which doesn't make sense, because if we're in the underworld and they're all dead pigeons, why would they even lay...
Hey, I'm back. Thank you for waiting. I had leftover Chinese food. That's good. Tofu and sweet sauce. This is basically the sound of me as a kid sitting outside my uncle's house on the main street of our local Cinco de Mayo parade. That's so fucking cute. Hell yeah. All right, let's solve some crimes. No, I don't even know what we're doing. All right, no, we need a, <laughs> we need a pigeon, which is ridiculous. All right, so here's what we need to do. We've been like recruited by some funky underground. We need to figure out why the Department of Death is like screwing over perfectly good people. At least they were fine when they were alive. And now they're ruining it. So we're gonna try to figure out what's going on and make it better. Is it kidnapping if they're still in their eggs? Huh? Wait, what's this open? Oh, it's a shortcut. Okay. All right, let's do this. Um, well, I don't know if they're even going to be able to get eggs because um, they're they're like undead birds. So the odds of them actually um, chickening is pretty low, I think. All right. Well, where are your nests? Hmm. Mm. Tom's office is empty. Oh, uh -huh. is it? There's nobody in Domino's office. Can I go in? I'm gonna try to guess his password. Am I? Egg napping. Nope. It's not Golden Boy. Ha! <laughs> I, uh, oh. Golden Boy is the name of someone I had an encounter with in Final Fantasy XIV the other night. I'm gonna try to. Oh. And it's not Mr. D either. Wait, what? Can I keep trying until I get locked out? So much for Dami. <laughs> Why would it be that? Arrogant fraud doesn't work. <laughs> I just got an achievement called Arrogant Fraud Doesn't Work. Alright, fine. What the? Hmm? What? There's something glowing in there. What? Take it. It looks like a glowing hunk of coral. What? What? No, I'm... No! I'm looking at it. Go back in. Why the fuck? Congratulations, Domino, on your new job. Hector. Hector? Congratulations, Domino, on your new job. Hector. Hmm. He doesn't even hide his booze in a file cabinet. What kind of salesman is he? Take it. No, don't drink it. God, Manny's so fucking drunk. I've made him drink like three things. Wait, what's up there? Pictures? Cheap paper mill diplomas. No use for it. Mm. I can't go strolling through the halls now. I'm on the lam. Oh, yeah. What a jock. Hmm? Hmm? The fuck? The hell is that? What a jock. It's attached pretty well. Hey, Octavia. It's Domino's mouthpiece. Ew. Ugh, Domino had this in his mouth. Well, it's mine now. Gross. Oh my god, the camera changed and I thought he was gonna come in and like kick my ass. Let's get out of here. You didn't specify how you would take it? I, that's true, he do, I don't have a liver. No messages in Dom's fancy red tube. He's got a lock on it. Can't believe he doesn't trust me. 
All right. It's Domino's mouthpiece. Why am I carrying this around? Yeah. Just a regular old balloon dog. I don't see what's so dingo about it. Hmm. I need one of your eggs. It's locked. Is that a wings? Oh. No, come back. I wonder if I can put like a. Mm. I was thinking I could scare them with the balloon cap, but maybe I need another fucking worm. But the worm can be the solution to everything. Uh, look at this bird. Love this inventory system. If just to hear the balloons. I have embraced a life of crime. Hey, look, bird. Doesn't do much but glow. Glow. Okay. I'm gonna go get another fucking worm. Maybe if I hold it out, I can catch a pigeon and then, like, I don't know. Do something. Hmm? There's pigeons up there, too. Hey, bud. Can I have another worm? I'm gonna take all his balloons. <laughs> My kid uh, wants an eye. Do you have any more? Look, if I give you any more of those, you'd be able to go in the business for yourself. Fuck. So forget it. Oh no! Okay. Shit. Okay. Okay, we're out of worms. That seems bad. I don't think I'm allowed back in here. I'm not going. They still think I'm locked up. Hopefully. Okay, let's go through the um the basement opening. Maybe my weird driver guy came back. Damn, I really thought worm was gonna be the answer. Faster, please. The driver demons operate this somehow, and the company won't tell a salesman how it works. Why don't I just go this way? Through there lies the Limbo Highway, and on the other side of that, the land of the living. Can't go through on foot. People have tried, but they never came back. Oh. Okay. Well, we're not doing that because I don't want to double die. Oops. This is where we escaped from, so... Can I... do this? It's locked. It's a tool cabinet. Not when there's a door. No one in there. Hey, what did they do with Glottis? What did they do with Glottis? It looks like it dispenses something called Philodent. Philodent. <laughs> Fill a denture? Maybe this thing? I can't even imagine a way to use coral there. Yeah, that's fair. Maybe this thing? <gasps> Teeth! Dent. Good for dents, great for dentures. Teeth so I can use his computer. Uh, hold on. Wait, did I just break it? Dude, I feel like I haven't done anything on purpose in this. <laughs> it's only been my accident. This mouthpiece is full of philodent. Okay. Are we playing with tank controls? No. I'm just clicking around. I'm just clicking around. <laughs> Fuck tank controls. Why do they put them in? Why would it be in this game? I'm so I'm so grateful that I didn't have to have them on for Silent Hill 2. 
Can we skip this? No. Why would tank controls be in any game? Agreed! I know some people really like them, but I'm not a fan. Granted, I've only played one or two games with them. Maybe games where you drive a tank? Alright, fine. Fair. The original release of this only tank controls? Oh shit. Well, I'm glad they changed that. Alright. I'm playing the only version that was available on Steam, so... Uh... Use. Look at my teeth. I don't want to make an impression of that. Oh, fuck. Maybe I have to take it out? Oh, no. I just had to press this button. Ugh! Wow, that made a perfect impression of my teeth. And like quite a chalky aftertaste, too. Oh. Oops. I don't want to mess up my tooth cast. Okay, I made a cast of my own teeth. I don't think that's helpful. I wanted to make a... Oh, fuck! Um... I need to refill this and I need to put it's it back where it was. Plastic cast of my teeth in it. Shit. Oh, wait. I can't go strolling through the halls no, wait. now. I'm on the lamb. If I put it back up here... I don't want to mess up my tooth cast. Shit, I was gonna say if I put it back up here... I bit it again. Yep, a perfect fit. Hmm? Nothing else in there. Of my tooth cast. Darn it! I was thinking I could take a cast of his teeth. Uh, the asshole, Domino. Maybe if I go fill it back up and bring it up here and then try to put it there, it'll be okay. But I don't know if I'll be able to fill it up again. And he doesn't want to mess up his stupid tooth cast now. No use for it. The drapes are drawn. Dom and Dom must still be in there. Hmm. I have done nothing on purpose. Everything I've done has been a fucking mistake. <laughs> Can I use this on this? Dog. Attached to dog. Okay. Oh, oh, oh! Grappling hook! Grappling hook! That's how Domino meant it to be used. No. Hiya. Oh, so I didn't have to do that tooth stuff at all. You'd have to be crazy to climb on that. Get on. <laughs> this puzzle had me stumped for days because you know I could pull the rope up. You should be like me and click buttons and then look at chat and then do it wrong. It's great. So I figured out like two things already. <laughs> also found that by mistake. I was just saying in Spoil Cemetery how I don't know how you'd find it if not by mistake. Yeah, I definitely did by mistake. Fuck. Why do I have this fucking mold on my teeth then? Hello, birds. There's no way you're just gonna let me get those. Whoa! 
look out for this cat. Meow, 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 meow. Okay, no. Man, I was really hoping the balloons would be more useful. Look out for this tooth. Why am I sliding? Get him off me! I think yep. it's because I. Yeah, I did two things at once. I'd make a joke or pun about your grim fate or your doom, but this game is too comical. So, this is all you get. Until next time, fools. Thank you very much, Frezzo. Back off, dog, dog. Dog, dog, dog. I'm warning you, you little roof chickens. Robert Frost, Destroyer of Pigeons. Isn't that what he's famous for? I should actually use him. Robert Frost, Robert Frost! <laughs> Fire. That's not on fire. Why don't I just use my sky? Hi, yeah. how to scare them. Fearless little smug squabs. <laughs> That's not how going with it is not going to scare anybody, dude. So I do. Why don't I just pop another balloon? Popping balloons definitely scared them last time. Pop. Pop. Where are you going? Run, you pigeons! It's Robert Frost! I just got an achievement called Run You Pigeons. It's Robert Frost. All right. Hmm. They don't look scared. I think they're actually laughing at me. What? They might not know how much scarier a dingo is than a regular dog. <laughs> Fire system. That's not on fire. Oh my god. All I have to do is pop it. Just pop it, bud. Don't make me touch you with this. It's got <laughs> Domino Hurley's germs all over it. I think I'm only scaring myself. <laughs> and mine! Oh, jeez. Thank you for the 99 bits, Wombat. Two roads diverged in a wood, and I took the one less traveled because there was a lot of bloody pigeons the other way. Nice. Alright, I think that's all my garbage. We're gonna have to find another way to scare them. Man, I thought popping a balloon would work. Well, at least we found it our way up here. Now we just need to figure out what to do. It's locked. Going near that pigeon makes it go away. The voice didn't read it though. It didn't, I'm sorry. It's um, it's limited to 100 bits and over. You were very close, but I, I read it. Does that work? Oh no. Sorry to button again so well. soon, but I just noticed the community challenge. I'm sorry you'll have to suffer this humiliation, Octavia. Now I know why you step on the game systems. I can't go strolling through the halls now. I'm on the lamb. Thanks, Rezo. I can't go strolling through the halls now. I'm oh, on the lamb. Oh, fuck. How did... Uh-oh. Oh. Hold on. I accidentally full-screened it. No one wants that. Crap. Fuck. Man, I broke the game. Hold on. <laughs> Damn it, go this way, please. I made this stupid cast of my dumb teeth. Oh my god, dude. What, do you want to look at this? 
dominoes and all these pictures shaking hands with dead celebs. No use for it. Not interested. I wonder if I can put... I don't want to mess up my tooth cast. Hmm. Have you done cast costume, costumes before? I never, no, we never have. The drapes are drawn. Dom and Dom will still be in there. Teach me your tricks, bird. How do I kill your friends? I mean, scare your friends. She does, she does sleep, sleep on my face all the time. All right, birds, I'm gonna figure out your garbage. Maybe I just need to like, go slow. Obviously, like this dish vent. It's part of the roof. I prefer to eat out of clean dishes that aren't nailed to the roof. Maybe that will scare them. Eventually. Maybe the dog? Dog. Hmm. Okay, well I can put something in here. Surely she'll be excited to cosplay her favorite game character, Hot Cat. Yeah. Maybe if I pop it now that it's out. of my blade. Manny, come on. For one day, Octavia will be a dog. Yeah. Deck of cars just wouldn't help there. It definitely feels like I'm supposed to use this dish to combine two items. I don't want to mess up my tooth cast. here and they've been using it what if I leave and then maybe they'll pop it when I go away compliment the game uh, 
it's uh, got very good voice lines so far. I really, really like all the characters' voices. They're not popping it. At least I don't think so. I can't get any more... I can't get any more um, balloons from the guy either. Yeah, no backseating ever. Thank you. Thank you for asking. Okay, so I can put balloons into it. of those pigeons. Shoot! Shoot! I don't have a net or a desire to have a pet pigeon. But we need these eggs, buddy. Maybe I can put them in more places. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chatterman. Aw, thank you. The skeleton pigeons are quite cute. Oh, there's one. Oh, yeah. Maybe if they leave here, they'll go up and pop the balloon? Pop a balloon. I'm not supposed to make a mold of you, am I? I can't click on them. Teach them to fear balloons. Hey ah! And then the friends upstairs will be like, shit, we're supposed to be afraid of balloons. How do they fly? Nothing makes sense in this world. I don't know. It's sheer will. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Pigeons don't know they're dead. They don't know they can't fly. Right. Just like orcs. If you believe it, you can do it. Maybe I should look at the slides about pigeons. Maybe that'll help us. Like bumblebees. <laughs> Agent Calavera here. Oh, the sun's coming. Go away, son. I want to be blind. Damn it, my headphone cable isn't long enough. Hey, tell me about your stupid pigeons. Have you thought about using messages tied to balloons? I can yeah. get you plenty of balloons. I can. Pigeons, Manuel. Bring me their eggs. Pues, okay. <laughs> Viva la revolución! Ah. Hey, I got you teeth. Thing. Why won't you help me out? I need your teeth, remember? Yeah, I figured. Oh, right. I got that for you. I thought you wanted his teeth. Here. 
Here's my teeth. Manny, this looks like a perfect impression of your teeth. We can use this as a mold to make a fake set of teeth and get into the computer system that way. Oh. Good work, soldier. I thought she wanted someone else's. I figured they wouldn't be able to use mine because... I figured they wouldn't be able to use mine because I had just been kicked out. Okay. So I just realized this side is... You happy now? Did I mention it's been great working with you? Don't Ditto, flirt. Kid. All right. Well, that's something at least. Now, pigeons. Have you thought about using messages tied to this? Viva la revolución! I'd put on a hand shadow show, but the mood just doesn't feel right. Hmm. Okay. Well, we did something. That's less thing to, to test, I guess. So now what do we have? Balloon, scythe, cards. It's just fucking balloons! Alright. Maybe I need like a needle or a pin or something to pop it. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, uh, gee. Can I have another cat? Hey, did you lose the one I gave you? No. Well, then just enjoy it for a while longer, all right? I'll have another dingo, please. Hey, did you lose the... No. Fuck. Well, then just... Bet you can't... Hey, did you lose... No. Well, then just... Do you have any more... Look, if I give you... So... Shit. Those crates are completely blocking the sidewalk. What if there were a fire? I don't need the hernia. They're just full of party What if there favors, were a fire? And I'm not in the party mood. Huh. What if there were a fire? I have a fire extinguisher. I could put it out. <laughs> Alright. There's gotta be... Something... I don't think I can go back in. I'm not going ah, either. But I they can... still think I'm locked up. Hopefully. What if there were a fire? We'd all die? Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, wait. We can go back in here. I wonder if I can use the elevator. I'm not going upstairs. <sighs> I want them to think I'm still locked in the shop. Birds. Balloons for days. This soundtrack, though, is Chef's Kiss. Glad. Ha, regular cars. <laughs> Ooh, I might get hurt if I try to get one down by We're myself. Snooty now. Me. Oh, here's one. Is this one unlocked? It's a tool cabinet. It's locked. Damn it. It's a tool cabinet. It's locked. in there who's afraid of a little rusty water maybe i could turn it into a bird not picking that up um <laughs> lucy lou thank you very much for following welcome that's not on fire Robert. Damn. Deck of cars just wouldn't help there. Deck of cars just wouldn't help there. <laughs> Ooh, ick. It came out like soft serve ice cream, but judging by the smell, I think it's auto body filler. I can't believe I put that on my fucking teeth, but I guess I am dead already, so it doesn't really matter. Dang birds.
Maybe it's contained up there. Maybe I don't need any extra stuff. I'm not allowed back up. Let's check that weird highway section again really quick. The petrified forest Rubacava. Not really that far away, but to me they might as well be on the other side of the world. I'm not walking on the freeway. I shouldn't even be standing here. I'm not walking on the freeway. I shouldn't even be standing I'm here. I'm sorry, Manny. I'm sorry. I remember the year they built that. Mostly because it cost so much, we didn't get bonuses that year. Da caños. It's very quiet for a freeway. I guess. I feel like I'm supposed to do something to scare the birds away. Huh? What's this? Red? Since I really didn't get to celebrate the festival oh! this year, I think I'm entitled to a little pan de muertos. Yes, bread. More. I'll just take a little more bread to honor the dead. Bread for me. All right, that's what I'm going to put in there. I'm going to lure the bir birds away with bread. All right, that's much better. The balloon. That oh my god. Be very good use of this special Oops. ceremonial bread. Shut up. Go up the thing. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> he scoots like a little a little s s worm man. Faster. Bread for burp. Mm. All right. So no cat. <laughs> Instead, we put bread. And let me take two breads, which is interesting. All right. Put cat away. The bread is hardly shaped like any poets at all. <laughs> yeah. All right, bread. Bread. Place. Oh. I mean, they would have eaten it normally, dude. Yes. Yes. I wonder if I can... I think I need to put a balloon under it, because then we can still scare them. Hold on. Uh, let's do rubber frost. It's only fair. It's a thing I got too. I hope it lets me combine them. Because it wouldn't let me put this here if there wasn't a reason. I think. I guess we're going to find out if it's that type of game. Alright. Add. Okay. Hopefully it pops and they all fly away. Please eat it again. I know you just ate. Pop. Pop. Yes! little ledge pickers sounds like a really bad insult hooray so that's where the vermin come from hey you must come with me young ones for I am the green reaper Manny you fucking weirdo take all of them man are those pigeons gonna be ticked but you're only taking two man are those oh, okay. pigeons gonna be ticked hey I fed them 
All right. I still have some extra balloon animals, but that's fine. Hope Robert, Robert Frost was well-bred. Haha. -ha. All right. Mission complete. Unless I somehow destroy them while I'm doing this. I hope not. Let me in. Agent Calavera and two guests. <laughs> Don't hold up the eggs like that, you weirdo. Fucking dork. Prefer Walt Wheatman? Oh my god, I want to die. Ugh. Hey, I got your eggs. Look. Uh, egg. <laughs> Check these babies out. Excellent, Manuel. With these, I can breed an entire army of winged messengers. Our Excellent. revolution can spread now across the land, carried on the shimmering wings of justice, thanks to you. Agent Calavera, you are a friend of the revolution, Agent Calavera. And now... And now? Let me be of service to you. You must go to the town of Rubacaba, my friend. If you want to find your lost soul, how do you know where she is? I don't, but everyone who wants to get to the Ninth Underworld must cross the Sea of Lament, and therefore must go to Rubacaba to get passage on a ship. Oh, jeez. As long as you get there before she does, you'll find her. But it may be quite a wait. I'll wait as long as it takes. Manuel, are you in love with her? Love? Love is for the living, Sal. I'm only after her for one reason. She's my ticket out of here. Hmm. We literally saw her for like five minutes. There's no way we're in love with her. What the fuck? That was some tunnel. I'm all the way to the edge of the petrified forest. I should... It's probably safe. Uh... That Salvador really knows how to do this espionage thing with style. Weird. Ah, El Maro, my hometown. May I never see it again. Wow, okay. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? God is my friend. Why are you crying? Betty? Oh, Betty! They fired me! <laughs> I mean... Me too, buddy. You don't understand, Betty. I was created just to do that job. It's the only thing that makes me happy. It's like they reached into my chest and pulled out my heart and threw it into the woods to... Gladys, what have you done? Did you just kill yourself? Oh, Gladys. I wonder how long he can live without a heart. Wake up, buddy. Okay. This signpost seems to be pointing the way to Rubacaba. Nah, it's too well anchored. It's funny that he actually tries to take it. Nah, it's too well anchored. Wish I could do that so I could sleep right away. Spider's wings. That just doesn't seem fair. Hello. Are you gonna hurt me? These spiders have Gladys's heart in their web. Uh, it's stuck in there good. Hmm. Can't I just slice it out? Yeah. 
piece of cake. Hi, Chihuahua. Don't think that's gonna work. Hmm. Bones? It's an ugly pile of bones. <laughs> Slice. Like me. It's <laughs> a good joke. I guess I could always use a spare. This is my bone now. Put it away. Take more. I feel like we should have double of everything. In case I fuck up. Did that work? Do we have two now? Bone. Ooh, something has sucked the marrow out. Okay, two bone. Uh can I distract it with bone? Soup's on! Huh, they don't seem very interested in that bone I put in there. Oh. <gasps> My balloon animals are gone! Mm. What about a second bone? There's uh, already yeah. a bone in there. Oh. Well, fuck. Take another one. That's music for. Would you like a bone in this trying time? It's not the body part he's missing. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it says bone wagon on the side. Oh, bone? <laughs> it's so funny because I have one of these in my yard right now. Bone? Take this I bone. I think the only bones this thing was meant to haul around are mine. Oh, I can go more ways. Okay. I can't just leave Glottis laying there. He could be dying. <sighs> What about over here? Can we leave him laying and go over here? You don't remember this? Did you block it out? Maybe. Without Balloon Robert Frost, the others apparently couldn't go on living, I, can't I guess. I just leave Glottis laying there. He could be dying. All that way and you found over oh, two bones? What is this target? I can't just leave Glottis Excuse laying me, there. Excuse me, it's called Spirit of Halloween. Dying. This signpost seems to be pointing the way to Rubacaba. Eh, it's too well anchored. Too well anchored. What if I use a bone to get it out? Bone! No place for a bone there. Damn it. Touch bones. There's already a bone in there. Okay. What do we do now that there's a bone? Uh, oh! Uh-oh. Oops, I skipped where the dialogue was, I'm sorry. Uh, Coco4625, thank you for following. Welcome, welcome. Well, I guess that worked. Glottis? Oh, there we go. Give me that. It's still where'd, beating. Where'd the bone go? <laughs> heart! Heart is good. Be good to heart. Don't tear out heart! Heart is good! Strong, beating, good heart! Hey, is that my car? Oh. Mr. Lamonds, I assure you the missing woman will be found. I will personally track her down myself. Just like you personally picked her up from the land of the living? That was my intention, but Agent Calavera somehow got to her first. We gave you the fastest car, Domino. 
We gave you all the best clients. You had all the advantages. So how was this Calavera able to sneak in there and eat your lunch? Oh, now, Hector, you can't get too mad at Domino. That wasn't his fault. Oh, I can, Don. You should know I can get too mad. But not at Domino. After all, he wasn't in charge of this operation. At least, not until now. Hector, no! <gasps> Marigolds. <laughs> Funny. Whoa. For some reason, I was expecting tulips. Well, maybe Mr. Calavera, eh, Domino? Why don't you personally go down to the basement and escort him up here? The sooner he's sprouted and we can get back to business, the better. Wanna go for a ride? I thought you'd never ask! Oh. <laughs> that was a weird cut. Alright, well my boss has been... Sorry. Murdered. Wait, what? Oh no, I don't want to drive this. Stranger Cat is chasing a squirrel on my back fence. One of these has to lead somewhere else. This feels terrible! And these used to be tank controls? Jesus. Loss of the woods theme. nothing in any of these holes. Oh my god. That was interesting. Manny, this is a low-riding street rod, not a 4x4. Four four. We don't have the clearance for that kind of road. I didn't have to go that way at all. What sort of unholy Christmas tree farm is this, Gladys? Gladys? Manny, check out this wheelbarrow, will ya? With a couple of ATV nubby tires on the back and a two-stroke lawnmower engine, we could make one sweet go-kart. Hmm. Hmm. He looks much better with his heart not ripped out. <laughs> Gladys, what are they doing to that tree? Oh, city boy! You work all day in a 60-story skyscraper, but didn't you ever wonder what it was made of? The marrow of these trees, man. They suck it out. It's like cement. Is that why the town's called El Maro? Huh? Never thought of that. Oh. That's... Maybe so. <laughs> That's fucking weird. Would make a decent go kart. What? Switch 
is up. Ooh, careful, Manny! With the harmonic balancer turned off, those pumps might shake that tree apart. Oh, but... Oh! If we shook the tree down, those pumps would dislodge, and I could make high-lift shocks out of them for the bone wagon! Hold on. I'm going to unbalance that wheel with some of these weights. That'll shake her down for sure. Uh, that doesn't sound like a good idea. Ugh. Can't you just pull Okay, the... just give me a second to balance these doggies. Uh. That should do it. Are you ready? What? Oh god, what did I do? <laughs> Walked hard for no reason. Still not enough. And maybe if I moved them around a little. If you move them around, do I have to move them around? Manny, please, your little legs. You should really be shaking the tree down, don't you think? I'd climb it myself, but I don't want to take all the fun away from Gladys. All right. Hey, while you have that off, let me try moving those weights around some more. This is weird. My friend is doing the work for me. It's renewable concrete. They're living in the future. Okay, just give me a second to balance these doggies. Maybe I'm not supposed to. Hey, Manny, what are you doing? Outside of the entertainment value, that didn't do what I had hoped. was a dirty trick, Manny. I'm sorry. Oh, it was an accident. I bumped the switch with my elbow. I thought it would oh, work. Okay. Hey, I learned my lesson. While you have that off, let me try moving those weights around some more. I thought that was what I was supposed to do because he doesn't do it right. Apparently, I'm just a jerk. Now, no monkey business this time, Calavera! I'm not touching it. That should do it. All right. Still not enough. And maybe if I moved them around a little. Again? I don't know. I think my method hey, is smarter. While you have that off, let me try moving those weights around some more. Hey, Ryder Ant. Now, no monkey business this time, Calavera. Maybe I am supposed to monkey business. Yeah. Oh, he's so trusting. I'm such an asshole. There's got to be some way I can help. Maybe with bones? Can I put bones in here? Oh, hey, Mug. No place for a bone there. Really? Do you want no a bone? No place for a bone there. Fire extinguisher. 
That's not on fire. Hmm. This, is this place gives me the creeps. I'm ready to go when you are. We can't. It looks a little dizzy. Oops. All right. Hey, while you have that off, let me try moving those weights around some more. Business this time, Calavera. That should do it. I feel like there's some type of time timing thing here I'm missing. No place for a bone there. <laughs> Still not enough. And maybe if I move them around a little. Dude. Interrupt the I see. All right, let's try that. Hey, Asiang. Hey, while you have that off, let me try moving those weights around some more. Maybe this will work. Because it's blocking one of them. Business this time, Calavera. That should do it. It didn't, it didn't do anything. Well, not yet, anyway. Still not enough. Damn. And maybe if I move them around, though. Okay, at least I kind of understand what I'm testing now. I hope I'm not supposed to fling him off while, while I'm doing this, because I feel bad about the two times I did do it. Now, no monkey business this time, Calavera! It's got to be something to do with blocking these. I don't that think I can do it. walk up and step on them either. Because I can't move while this is happening. Not really. Still not enough. And maybe if I moved them around a little. Hmm. Okay, let's try this one. Watch, it's gonna be the first one. That's gonna be so stupid. Or I'm supposed to fling him off while I do this. Hey, Which also well, feels bad. Hurry up. Now, no monkey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That should do it. Still not enough. And maybe if I move them around a little. What if it's not supposed to be on them at all? I guess we should check the last one before we fuck with that though.
That should do it. That's an interesting sound. I don't know if that was anything though. Oh, now he's gotta walk back. Manny. Still not enough. And maybe if I moved up. I think I have to fling him off. Fuck me, dude. I feel bad. Hey. Now, no. Trying to fuck it up, it's not doing anything. Did it work? Oh, it worked. I don't know why. I don't care. Manny, until now we scraped along the ground like rats. But from now on we saw like eagles. Heck, like eagles on pogo sticks. Whatever. Whatever. I was getting concerned that our transportation wasn't ostentatious enough. Get in. Or are you afraid of height? Okay, there we go. Good enough. All right, I'm allowed eight slots. <laughs> Up. Huh? Oh, honey, you're in a car. Oh, Gladys. There's a big old padlock on this outer gate. I couldn't take that off with my bare hands. What? Hey. Manny! What are you doing? Don't you know what's on the other side of that gate? No. Yeah, the way out of the forest. I mean, yeah. Demon beavers, Manny! They'll make you into a dam! Relax, Geppetto. I'm not made of wood. But Manny! They don't use wood. What the fuck? Oh shh. Okay. That's not on fire. Oh, go That's in the door. Oh my god.
thing! What the fuck? Okay, there we go, there we go. <laughs> Run for your lives, you buck tooth glow balls! What am I? Oh, 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 fuck. Put out your lights, my friends. Where are we going, Manny? Where am I supposed to get them all or something? They're like in oil, though, so it doesn't seem to matter. Maybe there's something here I'm supposed to find. Calavera, and I'm your new travel agent. Oops, I just scooped the screen. Why am I here? What are we doing, Manny? Oh, God. Oh, oh, I think I died. Hold on. Hey. I'm gonna fire extinguish you, That's okay? That's not on fire. Come on, Gladys. Let's crash through this gate and drive right over those little monsters. What? Mm, no way, Manny. Oh, those flaming bone beavers are mean. They bite, they claw, and if one of them wrapped around my drive shaft, I'd be picking flaming hunks of fur out of my U-joint for months. I'm not going down there until you get rid of them. Okay. Maybe I throw bones? Don't go in the car. Um. Oops. Bone. No place for a bone there. That's what you think. No place for a bone there. Oh, maybe I know. I'll put the bones down here, and then I'll knock them into the water, and they'll be like, oh boy, bones, and then they won't come back up, and then we'll drive through. Or something. Aha. Huh? Bone. I like to save bones for special occasions. Wait, what? What is that? Can't click on this. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Weird. Come on and fight, you platter pusses. Going like right there. There's gotta be a reason. I like to save bones for special occasions. <laughs> so weird. I don't know why I can click here. But I can't click here, because nothing happens. I'm not a doctor, admittedly, but those do look like bones. Huh. I hope it's not bugged or something. That's why I can't click there. Sound. 
Every every beaver in the water. Yeah? You like that? What? Look out! Okay. something from here that I was supposed to pick up. There's no door on this trailer. I think it's just a big generator. No trailer hitch on the bone wagon. No trailer hitch on the bone wagon. Something to do underneath, but I don't know what. We can't go back where we came from. That seems to be nothing. This area has nothing. Okay, okay. If I get touched by them, I die. This way leads me down here, and he walks up here, and this is like something I can't interact with. There's room here for something. Bone, place bone. I like to save bones for special occasions. Do I just hand one a bone? You like these, right? Bone. I like to save bones for special occasions. I just fucking stretched my screen more because I'm trying to click and it's stretching it. That's so annoying. Pain in my ass. No place for a bone there. Oh my god, it's I a like door. down there. Maybe now I go down here? And there isn't one to walk up there? No, they- you. Huh? That's not on fire. That what is it? more where that came from. Stop. Put it away. What is it? What do you see? Pick it up. Pick it up before they eat you. It's... What is it? It's a third bone! Ah! Maybe I need three bones down here. Maybe I need enough bones for all of them? Bone. Place I like to bone. save bones for special occasions. Hmm. 
All right, I think I'm supposed to be picking up a bunch of bones and stacking them down there somehow, but I need more maybe? Another bone. Take. Okay, that's a lot of bones. Let's see. There's no combine button, though. I like to save bones for special. Dude, we have so many bones. One, two, three, four, five bones! Something has sucked the marrow out. Ooh, something has sucked the marrow out. I have so many bones! Take your bones! I don't need all of these! I wonder if this thing is rated for rodents. Shut up. Wait, maybe he can attach it to the front of the car or something. Can you? Shut up. Can you use this? What are you doing? That's not on fire. I'm gonna kill you. That's not on fire. That's not on fire. Would you like this bone? Gladys, please. No place for a bone there. No place for a bone there. What if eventually it's not bones and it's an item? And I just have to keep doing it. And they're just trolling me by making it just be bones. Okay, so I'm full bones. These monsters have made a dam out of human bones. I'm as bones as I can be. What if I take a bone down there with me? Thanks, birthday shark. Maximum bones. I'm holding one now. Throw a bone in the water, maybe? Mmm! What? The fuck? Oh! Uh... Okay. No place for a bone there. Fuck you. Did it die?
Okay. Well, we are in fact killing them. I think I'm. Oh, no, I'm not out of boats! This is kind of fucked up. This is a weird puzzle. I definitely didn't put out, but whatever. Hey, I did it. Now it's quiet. Hey, dummy, we're going in. Okay, the beasts of Black River are blowing bubbles at the bottom. So let's power on through, huh, Glot? Manny, look at that badass gate. I can't drive through that. Why we not? We have to find the key. Ijole. Why do I have to find the key? Couldn't you help me, Gladys? I couldn't take that off with my bare hands. If only I hadn't thrown away that little hand exerciser Domino got me for Secret Santa. Can't I just use my scythe? Or are you gonna cry about how it's gonna get hurt? Even though it's a scythe. I don't wanna mess up my blade. I don't wanna mess up my, my scythe. Fucking Manny. Okay. More bones? <laughs> Baby? Ah, yes. More bones. No one can stop me from having more bones. That road leads out of the forest, I'm sure. But I don't think I'd get very far on foot. Plus, how could I leave without Gladys? It's true. How could we leave without Gladys? Time to restock, exactly. You can build a bone xylophone. What the fuck was that sound? I'm gonna take bones. <laughs> Stop having so many bones. No, these are mine. I don't need any more. There we I'm go. practically made of them. This is my collection. Don't judge me. What? Hello? Why won't you go down there anymore? That's weird. I can't get him to go down anymore. Fuck are those sounds? Alright, we're gonna go find a key. <sighs> Unless the solution is bones. No place for a bone there. I'm thinking the next project should be wings. <laughs> I left my tow truck back in my other suit. Well, the only other way to go is here. This 
signpost seems to be pointing the way to Rubakaba. Oh! Okay. Not right now. What if I just... Can I use it to make one of these work? Holy shit! Run, Minnie, run! Shut up. You can go without me. I solved a puzzle. Get in the woods. All right. Where did it say? This way? Fuck. I have to check where it's pointing. I think this actually worked. I'm afraid to each... Hmm? Oh, Glottis sounds keep getting me. Yeah. Somewhere. God damn it. Oh, eat anything. I see, I see. I'm just pointing somewhere. What are you doing? Walk faster. somewhere Please, your pathing is terrible. That definitely pointed straight up. Where are you going? Get in the car, please. I don't want to hear him anymore.
Maybe it's pointing me to where it wants to be. I did it! Maybe? What? Loteria. Okay... So the beaver thing wasn't even... Okay. I feel like I should have saved. Oh, a key! Danny, I'm scared of that sign. Why? It looks like some sort of they'll tear you apart bone by bone and build with you a human throne. Their buck tooth king will sit upon what once was you but now is gone. This key unlocks the gates of hell. Steady traveler, use it well. Oh, well, I already badgered. I badgered? I already beavered, so gimme. Can't pass up an old creepy key. <laughs> True. Shush. Don't mind these bones. It's the key to the gates of hell, I seem to recall. What's over oh, here? No. Shush. Shush, Gladys, daddy's working. Oh, it zoops around. Wait, what? That was right there? This outer gate is huge. I'll need Gladys to open it. Oh, yay! Man, I have to do it. I don't know if I like driving over people. They can't feel it. They're dead. You're dead. I would want to drive over you. That's because you and I, Gladys, are friends. Aw, Manny. Aw. Yay! Look at that big cactus. Oh, it's not a cactus. It's a tower. Hello? <laughs> He's just like me. Miss Colomar! We're here to save you! You drive hey, up somewhere. Hello! Back and the whole town's asleep. But I want a drag race. When they get a load of my car, we're gonna be the talk of the town, kid. Yeah. You're right. We're gonna have to find a good place to hide that road show. Speaking of hiding, I wonder if Mitch is here already. I'm gonna go see what I can stir up. Not a bad piece of real estate, actually. It's got potential. <laughs> you fucking dork, stop it. Stop playing with your stuff. Potential. It's the gold saucer of the dead? God, I hope not. Oh! <gasps> yeah, tourists. Hey. <laughs> Thanks. You gotta watch your step around here, stranger. Rubicabi ain't the quaint little port town she used to be. Well, uh, 
hell. Looks like there's a new vessel in town. Pardon me whilst I go check her out. What, my shitty friend's car? Or my friend's shitty car? My friend isn't shitty. I'm cold. I can't believe I just fell in a fucking... <laughs> hey, come back. Well, actually, it's mostly stock with a few mods here and there. So, would those be glass packs I'm hearing, or turbos? You fucking nerds. Hey. I've always wanted one of those jackets. There was this one high-pitched whine it was making. Really grating noise, you know? And I searched and searched, but I couldn't find the source of the noise until we pulled in here. Was it the blower? No, it was Manny screaming in the back like a cat tied to a cruise missile. Ha ha ha! That's a good one. Hola. Hey, Manny, Doc Master Velasco here says he's got a place we can dry dock the bone wagon for a while. Oh, yeah. We can't leave a beauty like this out in the fog or her chrome will get pitted. Pitted? Did you hear that, Manny? Are you folks gonna stay in Rubicava for a spell? Uh... We're here looking for a woman named Mercedes Colomar. I'm not too good with names. Did she have any distinguishing marks or a tattoo? Not that she showed me. Well, like I said, I'm as good with names as you are with the fog. <laughs> hey. How do you get around here with all the mist? Well, uh, when you've strolled these docks as long as I have, Pilgrim, you know where you are by the smell of the sea. By the sound of the lonely foghorn, by the icy touch of the cold, salty air. Wow! Manny, could I have an eye patch? No! Wait, no, we're not asking this. I might be here a while. Is there any work in this town? That's well, there's terrifying. lots of work down at the docks, but it's all union work. <laughs> and I just don't see you in that union. <laughs> what? Can I just ask? What is under Such the eye patch? Question. Because I know it's not an eye. Oh, well, when I was alive, I had an eye patch like this. This one's just for the phantom pain. And that one eye socket used to scream like a banshee when the trade winds blew, so I plugged her. Hey, Manny, we were in the middle of a conversation here. Hey, hey, okay. I want to sound exactly like that when I get older. I keep getting achievements just for talking to people. It's really weird. Gladys, you gotta hide that car. In a minute, Manny. I'm talking to Mr. Doc Master here. All right. Be good, you dork. That's no cactus. It's a space station. All right, I'm not gonna fall into the ocean again. Maybe. I can't actually guarantee that, but... Hello? This guy looks familiar. Mr. Flores, I'm ready to take you now. Manny Calavera, is that you? Didn't you used to be taller? <sighs> I'm looking for a woman named Mercedes Colomar. Well, no one's come through town by that name, and you can take it from me. I, too? I'm looking for someone, so I watch the comings and goings around here very carefully. What are you doing here? Well, if you must know, it's about my wife. I got word that she passed away not long after I, and that she too was crossing the land of the dead on foot. It is said that all lost souls come to Rubacava, so I came here to wait for her. Hmm. That's sweet, I think. How do you know your wife hasn't gone ahead of you? Oh, Manny, if she had arrived here first, surely she would have waited for me. You must love her very much, also. Yes, this is true. Of course, she also has all of my money. <sighs> what? Uh... I'll help you find your wife. What did she look like? Oh, here. I got this from the DOD and made copies to hand out. Isn't she something? She must have been beautiful with skin. Weren't we all? 
I'm here to reclaim that walking stick. I broke it over the head of some hideous monsters in the forest. Hmm. So, know a good place to stay in town? What's your price range? Somewhere around the high end of nothing. Then maybe, young man, it's time you started thinking about a job. <sighs> Can you get me a job here? Have any skills? Sales. Well, that does qualify <laughs> you for a certain position, but we only have one mop. I'm sorry, Manuel. I've got to get this place ready to open. Right. I'll let you know if I see your wife. She'll be the one asking for her beloved Celso. Celso. Man, she's gone, dude. That's that sucks. An achievement hmm. called We Only Have One Mom. Maybe I should place a personal land. I tried it, believe me. It attracts the wrong kind of women. That That's not what I meant. Hmm. Maybe I should place a personal land. I can't take it. All these doors have numbers and pictures of food on them. What's number 22? Lengua. Wow. It's been a long time since I had a tongue. Hey, how do you open these? You wait till we start serving. That's how. Hmm. Oh, that's him. Oops. All these doors have numbers and pictures of food on them. Maybe I should jump into the ocean again. I think I'll wait for the fog to clear before I try exploring town again. Damn it. Manny, you knew. I've always wanted one of those jackets. You sure a woman named Mercedes Colomar never came through this town? She might have. I don't know. I told you the first time, I'm no good with names. Hmm. I wonder if he actually gave me a picture. Oh. It's Celso's wife. Actually, I don't think skin would help. That's mean. Oh, <gasps> my bones! Arrgh. Hey, have you seen this lady? Ever seen this woman? Oh, if this is the woman you're looking for, take my advice. Forget about her. She sailed uh -oh. out of here weeks ago in a cozy portside cabin built for two. And she wasn't alone. Man. How do you know she sailed out of here? I don't believe it. It's a tough break, Junior, but you gotta face it. Here, look it up in my port log if you want it in writing. Six weeks ago on a Tuesday. Ticket for two, paid in full. Wait. I cracked the champagne on the bow myself. Hey, Manny. We were in the middle of a conversation here. All right, Gladys. Hey, it's hey, not like we have okay. other things to do. Look, I know how you feel, son. Once I lost a very special lady myself. I waved to her from the docks as she sailed out of port, and I never saw her again. What was her name? The SS La Mancha was her name. <laughs> but don't make me talk about her, because I, I just can't do it. It's a boat. All right. Man, I, gotta, I fucking just got here, and I have to tell this guy that his wife left. With all his money, as he waited here for her. <sighs> Rain, I want you to know if I was ever in the afterlife, I would totally fucking wait for you. I would wait forever. I would never leave. Are you sure I can't sleep in the back? There's only room for one. Hmm? Oh! Velasco's logbook says Celso's wife took a bunk with a hunk. Look at it. Celso, your wife sailed out of here two months ago with no. another man. <laughs> it's all in there. Oh, Manny. Is there a greater constant in nature than the treachery of women? Forget hey. about her, Celso. Have you forgotten yours? I'm going after her. You take over my job here. This mop at least will never let you down. That compass in the handle will sure come in handy, too. Wait, what? So fucking depressing. What the hell? Oh, Jesus. I hope he finds her. I hope maybe she thought. Maybe. Maybe. 
she thought she'd be able to find him and he went on ahead. One year later? Excuse me? I've been here for a year? I look so fancy. Hey boss, you gonna come downstairs? I got a customer asking for you. You know I don't like to mingle with the customers. Well, you may want to mingle with this one. She sounds like your type. Well, looks like a quiet night in old Ubacaba. Who's that? Hold the f- okay. Turn to a noir, I guess. I never got the point into point and click style adventures, but this is really good, right? Shit, man. Every mop has a compass and handle. Do I have an inventory? Uh... Oh, wow. All my stuff's gone. Okay. I hope that guy found his wife. I've never seen Casablanca. Haven't played this since I was like 13, so I barely remember some of it. Oh, of course. I'm glad you guys are enjoying this. This is I, not what I thought this would be like. <laughs> Hell, huh? <gasps> are you fucking a piano? Are you a piano player? Hello, Manny. Hola. I guess Gladys is good at anything that uses keys. What's that you're playing? Oh, this is just a little, you know, love song for a special lady. <laughs> you think she'll come in tonight? Who, my special lady? No. Mechi. You know what, Manny? I think she will. I got a feeling tonight's the night. Sing a little bit of that song, why don't you? Well, I only have this part. <laughs> Bone wagon. No! I like it. I don't know what I expected. Quiet night, huh, Cardinal? Day of the dead ain't good for business, Chief. But last night, remember last night, Manny? Oh, wait! You know, when we leave, I'm actually gonna miss this place. Ah, oh, Manny, why can't we just stay here? We got our fancy club, we got three squares a day. Max lets me take the bone wagon out on his kitty track once a week. Plus, we look good in these clothes. Gladys, I can't live in this world forever. It's not where I belong. I've gotta find Mecha and help her. Because if it weren't for me, she'd have been on that train a year ago. Okay, Manny. But it's been a year. Well... I'll let you get back to practicing. I don't need to practice, man. I'm good. God damn it. All right. Ah, Marillo de Oro. A very fine liqueur filled with solid gold flakes. Nothing but the best for my customers. My rich customers. Yes, I better take this with me for safekeeping. Okay. Ah, Marillo de Oro. Okay. A very fine. Interesting. So we're a bartender? Oh, it's a casino. Okay. Ah, my bread and butter, thrill-seeking rich folk with a poor grasp of statistics and probability. <laughs> Not while they're losing. An honest roulette croupier is hard to find, and guys like this, even harder. Everything okay down here? I'm going to need some more chips if Monsieur Lucky does not call it a night, so... Mm. 
police chief Bogan. Rubacaba's finest. Rubacaba's only, for that matter. You know, some people say you should always walk away from the table when you're on a winning streak. Oh, yes, but I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. Le numéro gagnant de 33, noir, entre les pas. 33. Chow Chilla Charlie in his regular booth. Black. Mind if I oh. sit down, Charlie? Of course not, Manny. There's so many new people. I, I mean, it is your club, right? Wait, what? It's my club? Right. So what are you doing in it? Didn't I tell you not to come back until you can pay your bar tab? Oh, <laughs> or they kicked me out of that cat track for printing fake betting stubs. So now I have to come here, Manny, which I love, which I love. Uh-huh. How did you print fake betting stubs? With this. Isn't she beautiful? Give the me. last time I was incarcerated, I shared a cell with the most dishonest con man I ever in. met. He was strictly small time, and I managed to steal this from him quite easily. Thanks. You never know when this may come in handy. Hey, give that back to me, Manny. Maybe once you sell your bar tab, hey, Charlie? Oh, Manny. Good job, Manny. You and I are on the same page. What else can you counter? I know. Nothing, anything. So can you make passports? Manny, you still think like a living man in so many ways. No soul needs a passport. Really? We are all citizens of the same nation, and our king rides a pale horse. Huh. So no passports? No. No, that little hologram is so tricky, you know? Hologram? How about driver's licenses? Sure. Just um, give me a recent picture, 50 bucks in uh, about two weeks, okay? When I think of something I need, I'll come back. I'm not a wishing well, Manny. That's a nice suit. Where'd you steal it? We're so rude. Manny, if you learn to play the odds like Chow Chila Charlie, then maybe you too can have a suit this fine someday. What? A fucking weird ass name. Why aren't you over at the roulette tables? The roulette is for lonely widows and Frenchmen. What? Why don't you get some slot machines, Manny? Everybody, old women, little children, they all love slot machines. Pokemon proved and that's I true. Have a system, an infallible system for beating them. All my friends are lonely widows and Frenchmen. Except me, Manny. I'm here to keep you sane. Now you want to sound like this guy when you're older? I think slot machines attract an undesirable element. Oh, well, we're all undesirable, That's Manny. That's true. Yeah, but your credit's no good to boot. <laughs> There's no credit in the... whatever. Tell me your system, Charlie. I can't tell you my secrets. Uh, just this. You have to become one with the bandit, Manny. You you have to get inside the machine and, and make it one to pay. On second thought, stay away from my roulette tables. Well, yeah, what the a club fuck? to run, so... Oh, yes. Please, Manny. Get on with your glamorous life. You're weird. Go talk to this person. I don't know how you're gonna ah, get over there, but... Ah, my bread and butter. Thrill-seeking ritual to with person. a poor grasp of statistics and probability. Le numéro gagnant, le 16. Rouge, Berremont, 16. Red. That accent's so fucking thick and good. What the hell? Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Sometimes French sounds really cool. Uh, where the fuck am I going? Hey, what's up? Oh, right, I had a Looks like Lupe's around. been in the sugar again. Huh? Sugar? Evening, Lupe. Hi, Manny. Oh? I have to tell you about my new organizational system for the coats. Okay. Hi. Think she'll come in tonight? Manny, you ask me that every night. What am I supposed to say? 
Well, you could be a little more encouraging. I just hate seeing you get your expectations up every night like that. I'm not giving up on her. Hey, I don't want you to give up on Mercedes. Just have more realistic expectations, that's all. Let's try that again, shall we? Think she'll come in tonight? Could be, Manny. Just hang in there. Thank you. It's my fault she's out in the woods alone, you know. <sighs> if you say so, Manny. <sighs> okay. Tell me all the details about your new Kochek system. Yay! Okay. I found all these plastic tiles in the back, left over from the automat, and guess what? They all have numbers on them. So what I'm doing is I give one to everyone who checks a code in there. <laughs> Excuse me. Manny, Wait, that's it? you're not even listening to me. <laughs> I go to all this work organizing your coats, and you don't even care. Lupe. Forget it. Don't pretend to care. No, I want to hear. I, I just know. sneezed. I'm someone sorry. Someone who cares. God, it's like she heard me sneeze and then it was mean. Please, tell me all about your new coat I won't sneeze this time. Really. Don't patronize me, Cal. How's the flow tonight? We're dead tonight, Manny. Everybody's back home for the Day of the Dead, I guess. Except for the casino. The casino's hopping. Why is it that all the people who don't go home are the same people who just love to gamble? Well, I guess when you've got nothing to go home to, you've got nothing to lose. Hey, we should put that over the door. No. <laughs> Everything okay back in the land of fur and fedoras? Everything's in order. It's beautiful. I can't wait for people to come in and try the new system. It's so cool. Okay. Back to work. Okay. <laughs> okay. She's very cute. Wow, it's completely different. Holy shit. A year here, and I like own the whole fucking place. Mechi? Manny, help me. I've been lost for so long. Why didn't you look for me? I did. You ran off. Why? Because you said I was no good. I've been all alone in the world for a whole year. Sir? And it's all because of you! Shitty co worker. Wait, what about Gladys? My game crashed. Okay, well, I guess she hit me with a bottle and broke my game. What a bitch. <sighs> Great. What, did I miss something and it bugged? You still have to compliment the game? Oh, fuck. Wait, what? Le numéro gagnant, le neuf, rouge, and very manque. Nine, red. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Mesdames et messieurs, les jeux, ladies and gentlemen, betting is closed. I can bug the stuff. Well, whatever. Uh, all right, all right, all right. I'll compliment the fucking game. I sure love that there's a save system so that when it crashes, I can go back to it. No, He's I really- been sending me messages like this for the last year. Agent Calavera, I have word that you arrived in Rubacaba safely. This is great news, as your service to the LSA may now continue. I am pleased to report the successful hatching of the eggs you liberated. The hatchlings, which Eva has named Manny and Meche, are quite healthy 
and eager to serve our cause. With luck, my next letter will be born to you across the sky by these young gossamer wings of truth. For the revolution, Salvador Limones. I'm not done reading it yet, but maybe later. My compliment is this game already has like a ridiculous amount of heart and the idea of relationships persisting into the afterlife is really cool. I don't know. I'm look, I'm a big sap. Ah, to sleep. Perchance to have nightmares about spiders and beavers. <laughs> Can't. What if Mecha makes her big arrival and I sleep through it? Yeah, about that, dude. All right, we need to like retalk to everybody, I think. Where am I? Okay, there we go. All right, we're gonna try to save after doing this. Quiet day. Uh... But last. <laughs> God damn it! Such a... Oh, this love song for a special... Glad you're an ethical casino owner. Single... I guess so. Oh, sorry, I'm skipping his song. Bone wagon. There you I go. Like it. I can't believe it fucking you crashed. Uh oh. You know okay. when we um, we got a Mac it. Plus, Gladys. I can't. I've got a. F <gasps> well, I don't. Our protagonist got a letter he won't finish reading. He's meeting an evil specter of his lady friend on a dock, and the whole game is subtle boning theme. Is the Silent Hill two again? Let's talk about boning theme. All right, so balcony is where, oh. yeah, let's make this here. I wonder why it crashed like that. It's a little Nothing concerning. Nothing but the, my, yes. I... God damn it. Oh, why am I holding this? Put that away. Money up. Sorry, I, 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 Rain warned me that this was probably going to crash a couple right. of times. Because apparently that's just the way that this game is, but I should have been saving more often. I kind of just went into autopilot because I was enjoying myself. How did you wait? Like, that's what I love about this game. If you literally never know what's going to. Oh, you never know what's going to happen next. The story is twisty and it's good. He was strictly small. Time Bad, the game crashed. Good news, we get to hear Bone Wagon again. Easily. Thanks. You never know when this may come in handy. Sorry, hey, I'm clicking, trying to get it to skip, but it doesn't always Maybe do it. Maybe once you sell your bar tab, eh, Charlie? Uh, what else? Nothing. Any. So can Matt knows. We are. So Man. no. no. How about sure? About when I. I'm. Why aren't you over at the roulette tables? The roulette is for lonely widows and Frenchmen. Why don't you get some slot machines, Manny? Everybody, old women, little children, they That's all the way love almost every game slot is. machines. And I have a... I'll think of... Uh -huh. I am just humoring you. Tell me you said... I can't tell you. You, you have... Gross. One second. It's still gross. All my friends. Except I'm here. I think so. Oh, yeah, but you're... That's a nice... Me... Then me... Well... There we go. Oh, yes. Aw, oh, thank you, Sakamurai. I did. Silent Hill 2 is beaten. That's two Silent Hills down that I never have to play again. Uh, I'm gonna save... Between those two spots now. You know? Oh, yes. But I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. Everything okay down here? I'm going to need some more chips if Monsieur Lucky does not call it a night soon. Not while they're losing. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen. Let's try this again. And hopefully the game does not explode. All right, we've got to talk to her, too. Even if she's made of sugar. <laughs> That's not what it means, Evening but... Hi! Think she... Me... What? Well, you... Um... Hi. Let's... Good. How's the... Word? Explore... Well... Hey! Everything... That is... I can... What? Oh? Yeah, okay. So what... <laughs> I 
feel so bad doing this. We Maddie, just saw it. You're not I go to or don't break. No. Cup some. Please. Don't. Okay. Oh. All right. Now, save over this one. Hopefully, it does not crash this time. Mechi? Manny, help me. I've been lost for so long. Why didn't you look for me? Lupe more I like cute. Boo. That's really Why? bad. Because you said I was no good. I've been all alone in the world for a whole year. And it's all because of you! That did seem very on purpose, huh? It's not like she was accidentally throwing a bottle out the window and it happened to hit him. This gonna be an annual okay. thing with you, Manny? Every day of the dead, you toss your bones into the drink and I fish them out? I don't plan to be around that long, Velasco. As soon as I find out where that ocean liner's going, is I'm after it. Ha <laughs> ha! That ship's going to Puerto Zapato. That's the other side of the world. Ain't That's no ship's hard. going out that way, but the old limbo here. That's not even But, but nothing. If the limbo's my only hope, then I'm already on board. Well, uh, good luck, son. That's all I got to say. May I save, please, so that I don't get sent to hell? Thank you. I wonder if it's because I was missing an item. Me and this ticket printer, we're going to make a mint. Calavera, it is indeed a great day for the revolution. Say hola to little Manny, the first enlisted messenger to serve the LSA. Please feed him some breadcrumbs and send him back quickly, so we may know that our maiden flight was a success. Aww. That dog master Velasco is one salty old bag of rope. <laughs> you should see his wife. Ugh. This is about as far as you got. Oh. All right. So I'm ready to sail. On what? On the limbo, man. Let's go. Manny, Manny, Manny. Oh, the the limbo's not a passenger ship. She's small cargo, son. And every hand on board works. I'll work. What are your skills? Sales and restaurant management. Oh, hey. We've gained a there whole new skill. one opening on the limbo's crew. Yeah? Yeah, it's in the engine room. And your buddy Glottis would be perfect for it. But he'd have to get his own tools. Hold on. I can't picture Gladys wanting to leave. We've made a home here for like the last year. What kind of tools does Gladys need? Authentic CB equipment only. How? Where do I get authentic CB equipment? Why don't you ask a CB? Afraid of getting stung? <laughs> Okay, if I get Gladys some tools, can we board? Uh, he can, yes. No offense, Manny, 
but there's just no place for you aboard the limbo. She's fully manned already. In fact, her whole crew is on board, ready to sail at dawn. <laughs> Except for that one guy. Mm hmm? Who's the one guy who hasn't boarded yet? Yeah, well, Seaman arranges a little late, but he'll be here before they sail. What job did Naranja have? He ran the galley. Aha! Restaurant management. Yeah, it's <laughs> similar to what you're doing now. <laughs> Except the fish is fresher on the limbo. What if Naranja doesn't show up? I can fill his spot, right? Manny, you're not even in the Maritime Union. I know that, and you know that. But we're two guys who can keep secrets, right? Gladys is exempt, but the captain will ask for your card. And if you don't have oh. one, they'll serve you to the sharks like chum. And what's worse, I'll get fined. That's a tough union boy, and I don't mess with them. I can fix this. Where do you think Naranja is? Probably home selecting recipes for the trip. What's going on in that bottle? A tugboat? This happens to be a perfect scale replica of the SS Lumbago. I'm just having a little trouble getting the walking beam to fit in the neck here. <laughs> That's funny. Because a lumbago is usually more of a problem in the lower back than the neck. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nothing. Mm. So let me get this straight. If I get Gladys some tools, that then hurts. I can get him a job on the limbo. And if Seaman Naranja doesn't show up for work, but he will, and I get a maritime union card, which you'll never get, then I can sail on the limbo in the morning. Jeez. I I'm guess get it. so. I'd better go finish packing. I, you do that, son. Okay, I need a maritime union card. <laughs> Why am I allergic to things? It's really because I looked in the sun. All right. Why did I just pick up the controller on my desk? That's nothing. Thank you, sir. This boat looks like crap. It's locked. I know. I locked it. You... Look at this fucking moon. It shone pale as bone as I stood there alone. And I thought to myself... How the moon that, that night, night cast, cast its light, light on my heart's true delight, delight and the reef where her body was strewn. strewn. Okay. Interesting ominous poetry that we just said in unison to the moon. This place is huge. No, go over here. Thank you. This gate only leads up to the Lombada dock, and the Lombada's gone. I've got the lumps to prove it. It's locked, but there's nothing up there anyway. This I've got the lumps to prove it. That's the folding bridge that connects this pier to the base of the cat track. sure what I hate more crowds or cats but I'm definitely not going near either one today oh okay Close time. No no more bets. oh wow somebody really liked this cat they don't have much use when they're alive and stuff they don't have much more beloved sandspoof this regal and majestic feline was a record holder for speed and a favorite of the crowds here in Rubacava for many years until her career was suddenly and tragically cut short on the second week of the racing season when the airship Olivia won on its maiden voyage. Many bereaved fans testified later that before the blimp hit, Sanspoof was in the lead. Okay. Poor Sanspoof. Fuchi, that smell is peor que la muerte. 
It says revolutionary design leaves can edges safe and smooth for Kitty. This is giant litter box full of giant cat poop. It says revolutionary design leaves can edges safe and smooth for Kitty. Okay, so now I have a giant can opener. That's weird. Should I open this? Now it smells like a giant cat litter box and some sort of gelatinous demon mystery meat product in here. The can opener wouldn't work there. Wet foods for winners. Mmm, smells good. But I'd rather eat my own arm. Poop. Go touch the poop, Manny. This cat litter really needs changing. See? This is why I don't have a pet. Tempting as it is, I just can't bring myself to jump in the giant unclean <laughs> kitty litter. <laughs> Why not? Aw, alright. That's fair, I wouldn't do it either. This is fucking weird, so there's like giant cat racing here? Looks like a great night for cat races. Why are there cats here? It's a beautiful day. Here Nobody at there. Hello. <laughs> oh. Oh, hi. Betting stub, please. What? I need the betting stub for the race you're interested in. Interested in. How? And the rest didn't seem the photo finish file for, of course. Oh, I, I don't have a betting stub. Oh, okay. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, you have 15 minutes to place your bets. Okay. I can probably use that betting ticket fake machine to make that. But I would need... Hmm. Nobody there. Anybody there? Look. I told you, we don't have any kitty hats today. What? You have to Get wait until Tuesday. Well, that's, that's kitty hat day. I don't want a kitty hat. Fine with me. What's your bet then? I don't gamble. It's a conflict of interest for me. Then why did you call me down here? For the friendly conversation. <laughs> you can't make that sound to me. You don't have any lips. Oh, sorry, monsieur, but this is the elevator to the High Rollers Lounge. That's where I'm going. It is members only. You must be new. And you must have a VIP pass to come upstairs. Adieu. Hmm. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen. This place is fucking weird. Hello. Wow, Manny Calavera. You never come up here to see me anymore. Well, I thought you could use the company with everybody gone for the Day of the Dead. In that case, Manny, why don't you stick around until six? That's when I get off. Ah, Carla. Did can we have I a try thing? out your metal detector? What's your sudden interest in metal detectors, Manny? Okay, Carla. I'm just a collector. Well, I'll show it to you when I'm on break. How's that? Busy night? Hardly. Everybody's gone home for the holiday already. Lol. This place is dead, and I'm bored, Manny. Bored. What's the shuttle waiting for? Uh, they're just cleaning it, but they're very thorough. We run a tight ship here, you know. Why don't you come by the club anymore? Well, to tell you the truth, Manny, it's your little coat check girl. All that bubbly energy, I just want to strangle her. Oh, I've tried on. that. It doesn't stop her. When's your break? Dawn. Oh, that's too late. I'm shipping out tonight. Yeah, right. I've fallen for that line too many times. I think it's time for your break. We could slip in the back for a little drink. You can tell me all about your job, 
The danger, the metal detectors. That back room's all business, Manny. And so am I. I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. What kind of business goes on back there, Carla? Strip searches. Hmm, and you don't qualify. Why don't I qualify for a strip search? Manny, I agree it would help pass the time, but we have procedures and rules here. And you never know when they're watching. I can only strip search people when a regular search turns up nothing. Hey, it's worth a try. Ooh, I love this part. What the fuck is happening? Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. I have so many illegal things on me. Oh, you're clean. Rats, Manny, I almost got to strip search you. A lot of paperwork. A lot of passengers. Everybody's back home but you and me. Hey, hey, official documents. Don't touch. When did you put in a floor safe? That's our new contained detonation chamber in case someone tries to come through here with a bomb. Since when does Rubicaba have a terrorism problem? This town's changing, Manny. It's getting tougher every day. It's locked. What the fuck? This is so fucking weird. I have no idea what's going on anymore. Where do you need to walk to, bud? I feel like hey, I was the new blimp is already in full operation. In it until the one Let's year just hope they fill it with something non flammable this time. It only goes to the land of the living, and there's nothing for me there. It's one of those game places that feels really lived in. I know that statue's supposed to mean something about justice, but I don't know. Could be a statue of a famous Olympic gymnast, I guess. This place is huge, and I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Reward offered for cargo stolen from shipyard receiving area, including a large suitcase bearing the initials HL. Offered for cargo stolen from shipyard receiving area. What a horrible jail cell. Then again, he sure taught Gladys a lesson that time. What? Only police chief Bogan knows how to get in there. Well, that's creepy. Late night at the morgue, isn't it, Membrio? Morgue? You know I can't sleep with John Doe's on the slab, Manny. If I don't ID these rose gardens tonight, oh. I won't be ready for the two that come in tomorrow. And before you know it, I'm up to my ass in his areas. They said ass. Hey, GT. The <sighs> okay. I think Membrio could really use a nice tropical vacation. What a sad story. These stews sprouted and no one came down to claim them? Death makes sad stories of us all. How's business? Booming, unfortunately. More crime every day. And more and more sproutings like these. Something's happening back in El Moro, I think. 
and its dark hand is finally reaching us here in Rubakava. What exactly are you looking for? I am digging for a treasure that part of me does not wish to find. For when I uncover that sad doubloon that tells me who this poor soul is, my reward is not riches, but the chance to make a phone call and break somebody's heart. Of course, with this equipment, the search could go on for some time. Do you ever worry that your job is getting to you, Membrio? Well, forensic botany is a trying job, Manny. But have you ever spent much time here with a florist? In life, they became florists because they love flowers. But here, a flower is a symbol of pain, of death within death. Their conflicted feelings build and build, and eventually, they become quite mad. Thanks for the tip. I guess I'll send balloon bouquets from now on. Holy shit. Can I help? Sure. Grab hold of this leaf right here. Manny? I can't do it. I know. I was just testing. How do you do this job? Without becoming jaded, you mean? My secret to happiness, Manuel is that I have the heart of a 12-year-old boy. I keep it over here in a jar. Would you like to see it? No. <laughs> no. Sorry. Old coroner joke. And Rio, why do you stay in town? Why don't you head off toward the Ninth Underworld? Manny, you can only search for something for so many years before you stop believing in it altogether. You don't believe in the Ninth Underworld? Why do you think we're all here in Rubakava? Because you're waiting to earn off your time, or you can't afford passage, or... Manny, we've given up. All of us. When you've been here long enough, you will too. Well, don't let me bother you. Always nice to have visitors. Jesus, fuck. Any leads? I know it's a poor coroner who blames his tools, Manny. But how am I supposed to turn up anything with the equipment they give me? Hey, I had a government job for years, man. I know how you feel. Is that like a bent fork? All right, that makes a lot of sense then. Do I have anything I can give him? Maybe this? Some great writing in this game. Always heard good things about it. Yeah, it is really good. Do you want... It's, um... Kind of creepy good. Take this. The can opener wouldn't work there. Oh, okay. Oh god. Sorry. this fish uh oh ah oh mm -hmm. who are you hello fly people ah bees Oh wait, I was supposed to mm. do something These about these. These don't seem too busy. Cold one, huh, Terry? Yeah, it's always cold when you're unemployed, Manny. <laughs> Who's unemployed? Aren't you guys in the union? The union? <laughs> they don't look after us, little guys. They're run by the coppers. And you of all people should know, Manny, that the cops are in bed with the gambling joints. Hey, I run an honest joint. This is probably we not true. With nobody. What about the protection money? We pay every week. On the nose, through the nose, like an honest place should. <laughs> See what I mean? This town is just a big conga line of hustlers. All laughing and dancing and scratching each other's backs. 
If the union is crooked, why don't you register a complaint? <laughs> That's a good one, Manny. Did you hear that, guys? He thinks we should register a complaint. If the cops own the union and gambling's in bed with the cops... Yeah, yeah, and then who really runs the gambling, right? Well, no offense, but uh, Max Amino is really the big boy in town, obviously. But word is, he gets his orders from some hardcore gangsters in El Mero. Yeah, that fancy cat track is really just a big... Laundromat, mm. if you get my drift. Okay. Why aren't you guys up there working? You don't know the deal down here on the docks, do you, Manny? If you want to get the jobs, you have to pay the unions extra dues. And that ain't cheap. We don't pay, and so they put us on barrel duty. You bees are being exploited. You should do something about it. Yeah, what can we do? We're just a handful of unorganized drones. We don't know nothing about nothing except just how to take it on a chin. Since you're not using your tools, think I could borrow them? Well, we sold them to feed our families. Then how are you ever gonna work? <laughs> I, I told you things were messed up down here, Manny. I, I told you. Hey, can I borrow one of your union cards? What are you kidding? This is you depressing. know how much I had to pay Chow Chilla Charlie to get mine? Chow Chilla Charlie? Then it's probably fake. But if I could just make a cut. Mm. You guys know a seaman, Naranja? Nah, CBs and sailors don't mix. But you're in the same union. Well, maybe so, but some traditions are sacred there, Manny. Why don't you just pay the union off then? We got our pride, man. He was straight stingers, you know? Not to mention we just don't have any cash to spare now that we're not working. I mean, it's like a problem where, uh, uh the solution uh, makes the problem, uh, worse. Like a catch-22? Yeah, wow. I wish I knew words like that. I don't want to say you're a bunch of complainers. I can't tolerate that's not all true. this injustice. I'm leaving. Things just aren't the way they should be down here, Manny. It's like the worker bees. They do all the work. But we can't affect the, uh, the, uh... Ah, it's like the way that things are produced should be controlled by... I mean, we should... Ah! Forget it. I'm just a dumb, hungry, out-of-work bee. Yeesh. Well, that's, that's fucked up. Oh, oh, this leads here. Okay, so we did like a huge loop and went up. Okay, I see. Blue casket. Viva la revolucion. Hey, thank you, Eldine. <laughs> this is so depressing, what the fuck? It's like we went from depressing Silent Hill 2 to depressing, but in a different tone. Hey, look! Deadbeats! <sighs> Hi, what's your name? She ignored me. Crazy. But don't you see? When the government fades away, so will our troubles. Ah, nonsense. We will always need some armed force to fight off the return of What is this town? That sort of fascist thinking is as dead as you are, comrade. When we get rid of all the guns, that's when people will begin to self-police. And the public opinion alone will keep them from committing crimes. Hola, trust funders. Hey, look <laughs> who's making the scene. It's Manny Calavera, the up, the down, the backside of the nouveau riche. Be the dinner jacket. We're talking about things you wouldn't understand, like truth and beauty. He has a suspicious red book. Labor organization and revolt made easy. <laughs> hey, can I borrow this book? Why? So you can freak out our plans for organizing labor and go rat us out to your pal, Chief Morgan? Hey, I'm just looking for something to read on the can, all right? No dice, Cumberbund. Hmm. I wonder if I can give those to the bees and help them unionize. But like, oh, just union. What? What is this fucking game? I'm so confused. Do you guys want some alcohol for this book? I don't really want to do that. Oh, 
This is very different all of a sudden. More hip cats. Hi, what's your name? You just blow cigarette smoke at me? Jerk. Lola? What are you doing? Another here? person. This crowd doesn't go much for souvenir pictures, except maybe of Lennon. Shh. Manny, I'm on a stakeout. I'm gonna prove to Maximino once and for all that Olivia's no good for him. Still hung up on Max, eh? Take my advice, Angel. Forget about him. He's a gambling racketeer. <laughs> like you. Oh, that hurts, baby. Hey, shh. Here they come. Come on, sugar. How about a kiss for the road? Oh, ick. Don't let me down, Nick. You're a lawyer. You're not <laughs> what did her head just do? Feelings. I don't, but I know a good tart when I see one. Hey! If Maximino sees that, we're going to end up in matching terracotta pots. Don't be silly. He wouldn't hurt me. He loves me. Uh. Manny. At last, we're alone. Tell me, how are the bourgeoisie? Fine. How's Max? Oh, Gramps. Ma'am? Don't start. You're... Okay. I think your bones are broken. What are you doing with a snake like Nick? I'd lay it on you, Manny, but uh, I don't think you'd get it. Messing around with your boyfriend's lawyer is pretty dangerous. Oh, maybe I was wrong. You do get Stop it. Stop jiggling. I'm a little worried about Lola. That's because she's doomed, Manny. She fell in love with Maximino. That's the one mistake I never made. Do you think Nick would hurt her? Only if he finds her and take it from me. He's not good at finding things. <sighs> What's this game rated? Open mic night seems like a big hit. It always takes those timid souls a while to get up the nerve. Maybe it would help if you went up there and started things rolling. Oh, Manny, read poetry in my own club? That would be like this whole place was just a big temple set up to worship me. A little dark in here, don't you think? Dark and cold, like the hearts of men. Uh... Oh, come... Okay. Alive. We yeah. slept. Life's just, just some rapid, rapid eye movement. movement. In a warm, cozy bed. Buried. We, we wake. wake. The flesh dream is over, Daddy. Now, now that we're all crazy and dead. That was great. Yeah, but that's the last one. You know, I'm thinking of buying this place. Really? I thought about buying yours for a while. But then I just decided to ask my boyfriend, Max, to buy it for me. You can have it. I'm leaving town. Manny, you sound so exciting all of a sudden. Why are you leaving town? Stop jiggling. Johnny Law, baby. You see, I'm a grifter. I'm bad news. Yeah, right. You're running after that ghost chick everyone says you're still so uptight about. Well, She's I have a wrong. poem I wrote Stop just it. for you. Pay attention because it's pretty short. Here it goes. Ah, 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 How about another poem? Okay. Ashes to ashes. To ashes to ashes. To ashes to ashes. To ashes to ashes to me. To ashes to ashes to ashes to ashes. That was great. Yeah, but that's the last one. How about another poem? Okay. I, I called, called my, my cat, cat Boney till she, she said, said it wouldn't, it wouldn't do. do. I, I said, said why? She, she said, said sister, because that's, that's what, what I've been, been calling, calling you. That was great. Yeah, but that's the last one. Sure it is. Hey, how about...
How about another boom? Okay, okay, okay last, last one, one, folks. With bony hands, I hold my partner. On soulless feet, we cross the floor. The music stops, as if to answer. An empty knocking at the door. It seems his skin was sweet as mango when last I held him to my breast. But now, we dance this grim fandango. And will for years before we rest. was great. Really? This time I just She don't said have the thing. More. She did say the fucking thing. Well, catch you later, hip chick. Keep practicing that lingo, man. You'll get it. Holy fuck! What the hell is this game? That did save, right? Yeah. Thanks, Boots. How are there more people? What the? What are you doing? Just the dab will drop you. Hey, man, you uh... didn't see me put the secret ingredient in these coffin shooters, did you? Relax. Olivia stole the recipe from me in the first place. Yeah. She steals from the rich and gives to me. That was great. Thank you, Luciano. That actually was a really cool poem. Like, what the fuck? Oh, b bye. Can I have this trash now? Sink water? The sink is full of dirty hookah water. Ugh. I'm not gonna drink dirty hookah water, and I can't carry it with my bare hands. Nothing in the dishwasher. Not to sound like a capitalist oppressor, but I have people who do that for me now. I don't get the feeling those cleaning supplies are used much around here. Let the waiter clean up after himself. These plates are filthy. I'm not gonna eat off of dirty plates, and I'm not... Ooh, food waste. As soon as I think of a use for stinky food waste, I'll give it a shot. I could put it in here. Ah, Marillo de Oro. A very fine liqueur filled with solid gold flakes. I don't really want to do that. Really? Well, maybe just a sip. Whoa. Ah. I don't really want to do that. I just got an achievement for drinking that. Okay. Okay, dude. Oh god, they're drinking that. That's disgusting. Oh. Yeah, dude. Wait, can I get them to drink it and then I can steal their book? Hey, are you okay? Strong stuff. That ought to kill the pain. Hello. Hmm. No effect. Interesting. Where'd he go? More hip cats. Fuck. Labor organization and revolt made easy. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. Hmm. I definitely feel like I need that book. That's the weird elevator thing. Here. There it is. 
Max's giant cat racetrack. How's a regular guy with three roulette tables supposed to compete with that? now why is this place so big oh sailors huh? are you attacked oh that's cool looks like it hurts Looks like it hurts. Hola, Toro. Como estas? Uh, not now, Manny. I'm in the middle of something with Naranya here. Oh, you're him. Looks like it hurts. Hello, dude. Looks like it hurts. What's that you're working on there? I told you, Calavera, not now. When am I supposed to switch his drink? A lot of stains for a guy with no bodily fluids. Ugh. I really doubt I'll be touching that anytime soon. That's one old fridge. I bet I can knock him out with the stuff that they're giving the other people. Give me that. Strong stuff. That ought to kill you. Should, but you don't. I killed the pain, turn off my drill, stop working. How about that? No, no, no. I can take it. Bring it on, pops. I'll pop you, silver boy. Whoop! I need that. You need to hold still, or I need to strap you down. There's stronger stuff than that in there already. Hmm. I think these are binders of tattoo designs. They're labeled nautical and nice, and a third one just says anchor mania. Me and Shag fight alone. Me and them fuck your bell pull fire. Oh, that reminds me. I forgot about my date with Inez. What? Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, baby. How'd you know? Hey, don't say that, sweetheart. You know I meant to stop by and... I'm more happy about leaving town every minute. What the fuck is happening? Okay, so I'm pretty sure I need to somehow get that weird alcohol mixture into that bottle. To knock him out and then make it so he can't go to work but i also feel like i need to <laughs> teach the worker bees to assemble no no go in it's not where i came out of do i have to what okay Has, uh, Naranja checked in yet? Uh, no, but the boys never missed a boat yet. I better go. I. Not a bad little ship in a bottle you got going there. Yeah, well, there's that Rubicava craft fair next week, you know, so. Cute. Give me that. Here, let me help you with that. Ah, there's some things a man's got to do for himself. <sighs> All right. Wouldn't they just need paint instead of tattoos? Probably. Why won't you go in here? This gate only leads up to the... I've got the lumps to prove it. Hmm. 
Very weird. Tattoos that would last for the rest of your online. Oh, what's wrong with Julia? Yeah. I fucking did it again. We're about this. ready to start. It's Leeward Louie. Tiger Lily. Scratch Pole Junkie. Kitty Kitty Bang Bang. Kentucky White Ball. Big Furry Bastard. What? Balls 2. Old Scatter. The fuck kind of names are those? In the lane, right out of the gate. Leeward Louie. Old Scatter having a little trouble. And it looks like Leeward Louie. But here comes the challenger, Tiger Lily. Someone's gaining on the outside. It's Scratch Pole Jockey. <laughs> Wait. Mmm, smell. I don't really want to do that. Come on, game, show us the cats. Yeah, I'd like to see the cats too, but I don't think they're going to show us. And this giant one. Because he doesn't want to go down there. Yeah. I don't know where to go. I'm very... I wanted to go back to where I started from, but I don't think I can because I fell. Don't seem too busy. What's the buzz? Yeah, it's bad down here. It's like we want to control. Like, uh... I think you're just a bunch of complainers. You don't know what it's like, man. Every day we come down here, we try and make an honest living. We, we find out that you gotta be a crooked bee to win down here. He knocks the pollen out of you, man. He makes you weak. You bees gotta be strong. Easy for you to say, topsider. Hmm. Me and this ticket printer, we're gonna make a mint. I'm keeping this little gold mine to myself. Hmm. This is a tool. Do you, you want this? The can opener wouldn't work there. Manuel, I am sorry to hear that you have not heard from your meche. You must be patient and let your heart. Oh, I'm ah, reading the fucking letter. still water. thinks I'm in love with her. Try going this way yet? If we can, yeah. There we go. was that raven sitting there? Lola, Lola, where are you? It's bolted down. Hi, Manny. I have 
a note for you from Lola. Lola? Oh, yes. Now, where is it? Where, 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 where? Oh, here. No, wait. Dang, I have a whole new system for messages. Just let me... Here. No, no, wait. Ah, be quiet. Here it is. Wait a second. It's empty. There was something inside. It felt like a key. A key? Yes! But did somebody come back here and snake the key while I was sorting the coats? Who would do that? They messed up my whole system! Hmm... Looks like Lupe's been in the sugar again. Evening, Lupe. Hi, Manny. Okay, back to... Okay! Hmm... Somebody stole a key meant for me. That's fucked up. What's it? <laughs> Looking sliding. I guess Gladys is good at anything that uses keys. I just had a run-in with Domino and Meche. We're leaving town. What? What? How? Domino's got Meche. We're going after them tonight. What should I do? Just sit here until I get a boat. Sit here. Check. Okay. Sounds good. I know it. Well, that's not helpful, though. Hey, I need your help. Manny? Can you make reasonable union cards? Manny! Are you going to start moonlighting? Or are you just looking to hang out with the sailors? Can you do it or not? Hmm. I have a deal for you. If you can retrieve my money from Maximino, I can make you president of that crooked union. I don't need to be president. And why does Max have your money? I put a whole suitcase of it up for collateral on a rather large wager last month. The race was fixed, Manny. They stole my money like common thieves. Here, take this VIP uh -huh. pass and use it to get into the High Rollers Lounge. Yes. They won't let me in there anymore. There should be a safe somewhere in the wine cellar, and my suitcase should be in it. And you can get me a card tonight. If you make it back, Manny, the card will be on the table. Okay, safe in wine cellar. Now we're going somewhere. All right, good. Shush. Monsieur, fed for sure, if you play. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your beds. Okay, High Rollers Club. We need to go back to the cat place and we need to go up those weird stairs. I think we finally traversed this entire locale, at least. Oh, that's my bedtime. I don't think so. Uh, cat place. No, not this way. Over here, Manny. Unless my clock is magically off, but it should be it should be fine. I think I took the long way. Really dark. I don't know if that's any better. All right, weirdo cats. Whoa, what are those fucking things? It's like snake people. Uh, and then in here, and then over here, I think. Hello, I'm a member, jerk. I'm sorry, monsieur, but here's my pass, Jean Claude. Now shut those Ladies doors and drive. Aha! Uh -huh. oui, monsieur. But actually, my name is Raoul. <laughs> okay. results I don't have the remote and I don't think they get any other channels anyway so he said it's in there's a safe in the wine cellar I guess that could be wine
Looks like cans of some sort of canned meat. Oh, I really hope this isn't where the old race cats end up. I don't need any cat meat. That's fucked up. Looks like a turkey baster. Mine. I bet I could move alcohol to make a man fall asleep with that. Hmm? Looks like the pantry. Looks like the pantry. Looks like more of that cat meat or whatever that is. I don't need any cat meat. Ugh. Looks like more of that. Why cat is it all meat cat or whatever meat? Whatever that is. Hmm? It's the button for the elevator. Hmm. 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 Oh. Hey. Busy as ever, I see. <laughs> Busy as ever, I see. <laughs> hey, I'm not allowed to talk Busy to you? Okay. <laughs> Come for yourself. This is horrifying. Who needs a giant 24 karat gold cat? Ah, who needs a cat, period? Hey, cats are good. Good kitty. All right, you know what? Let's save talking to this man for tomorrow. Uh, I'm gonna save right here so we know exactly where we are. Hey, thank you guys for being here. I hope you've had a lovely Thursday or whatever fucking day it is. Um, we'll keep playing this tomorrow. What an odd place to end. It is. But you know what? It is what it is. It's timing. This game is really fucking weird. But that's okay. We'll keep playing tomorrow. Solving puzzles and probably causing problems for everybody in the towns where I live. Oh well. Have a good night, everybody. I'm gonna go pet my real cat and not think about cat meat.